yeah. Hey. So what? When I find a nigga who's a board member and suck his dick, and then you'll win awards. So it's, it's so it's gonna be fine to buy the awards then. Uh, uh, we're not That's buying them. We we win them. Yeah. We don't buy them. I didn't spend a cent. Yeah. I spent the money on recording the album and made sure that the album is the best album. Uh-huh. And it was nominated against two, Burner Boy and Wizkid. So now my wife can say to my kids one day that, yeah, your mom won this summer against Burner Boy and Wizkid. Hey. <laughs> Come on. Support documents. <laughs> History. <laughs> you know, then it was on SABC when it was broadcast. Yeah. You watch that, yes. And the winner and the nominees are Wizkid. Benna boy, boy, Buffalo Soldier. <laughs> you understand? And then who won? My wife. Done. Simple. Congratulations, sir. You understand? Can we start? We yeah. started already. <laughs> <laughs> hey, y'all go by the name of the boy KMG, and we are the conversation with Steady and Kamo. Unfortunately, my co host is not here. Mm. She was supposed to be here, but she's not here. What is she doing? She's on uh, period leave. PMSing. <laughs> nah. Because women now need leave for periods. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> you need, uh, everything you need leave. Oh, we have periods. We have that, we have that poli- we poli- have periods. But around. we have we have that policy in our in our uh, organization, the conversation. That's so stupid. if you're on your period, then you can go. Yeah, that's off. why my company is gonna kill your company because <laughs> we don't hire people who complain about period pain. <laughs> we don't <laughs> hire people. My company will be working while yours are busy on period leave, dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we'll be making money, dog. My kids will go to better schools than your kids, dog. Hey. Your kids will work for my kids, dog. Hey. Just let that sink in, dog. Nah, no, nah, I'm not gonna let <laughs> Let it sink in, dog. You need to understand the reason why I've got an attitude like this is because mm-hmm. when I was growing up as a kid, everybody worked for me. Everyone worked for you. Yeah. As a kid. Yeah, because my But dad, they still do even now. No, but my, they, everyone worked for my dad's company, right? Yeah. Everybody that I met worked for my dad's company. What was your company your dad doing? He was doing construction. Construction, yeah. But the point is this when I would go to my dad's workplace, mm-hmm. every, everyone works for me. Right. They're all my dad's employees, right? Mm-hmm. So they work for me. They I'm the boss's son. Yes, yeah. I'm Master Baloy. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? So yes. So yeah. everybody, everywhere so, I went, so everybody every, worked for me. So every time when you say people are working for you, it's through associates. Like if you have connection with this person or no, if you have a best connection, dog. When the guy does whatever bricklaying, he takes yeah. the trophy and he does that, and they pay him, right? That pays my school fees. Mm. That pays so when I want to buy sweets. Yeah. That money that that guy is working for buys me sweets when I want sweets. Yeah. That guy works for me. Yeah, yes. Ah. Because anything in that swipe, I swipe, I swipe, I swipe. You know, Osha Pastel. Yeah, Osha Pastel. Yeah. Let's enjoy the final conversation today. Yeah, we, got, we got Nota, the authority. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. That's why. So that's why authority comes to me naturally. Because yeah. since I was a kid, everybody worked for me. Yeah, Let me tell you how it and I like the f- started when I, I opened my mouth for the first time. I cried, and then everybody ran and said, What's wrong? Let's fix it. What, what, what's, what's going on? Chief, what do you need? And like that. My whole life. <laughs> you have been doing it like See, that. I, I just, it's like, it's, what like, do you need? it's like what you're doing now. Every time when you open your mouth, it's, it's like, What yeah. do you need? What do you need? What do you need? Hey, okay. <laughs> Give it. Give him money, whatever that you need. Give him what he wants. <laughs> Otherwise, you're good, bro. Yeah. Good That's to have right you on the conversation. Thank you so much for, for hanging with us, man. It's very hot. Fuck. Uh. <laughs> 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 Thank you so much. No, but I, th- but I think, I think uh, I like recently we've been experiencing hot temperatures. Let's say something, We went on holiday once, ne? Yeah. So we take my sister's Yaris to the holiday place. We go to Palabo. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, okay. Ne? We yeah. To Kruger National Park, clean. Yeah. So obviously, Yaris has got that boots that you open like this. Mm-hmm. And then, Dad, we're unpacking the bags one by one. It's hard, dog. So unpacking the bags takes for fucking ever. You know, it yeah. takes forever until you finish the bag. My dad forgets that he left that motherfucker open the whole entire time. The True. sun's just been beating down. After packing the bags, he wants to close the thing. Ah. <sighs> Did he burn his hands on the stove? <laughs> ah. What's <laughs> 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 It's one of, it's one of those places that you can you can boil eggs or you can fry eggs there. The man hey, is man. crying because he tried to close the boot. But it, it has been crazy, man. It has been hot, man. I must say. There's a heat wave. There's a wood wave. It doesn't like, rain, and usually yeah. got, like the rain clouds. There's a high pressure system uh-huh. that comes in, you know, in the springtime and brings thunderstorms from the northwest. Ah, okay. You know, and that's what's supposed to be yeah. happening in our thunderstorms. You know what I mean? 
So the biggest oh, yeah. catchment area for those rains and everything else is like, you know, they go through these mountains here, they get caught up in the dam by Artis, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? And then they also pass through and they fill up the bar, etc. They run all the way down to Free State, these thunder showers. You know what I must say now? And we're not getting them right now. Yeah. So this is, this is a drought. So we're in a drought exactly. and it's really dry and it's really concerning because, you know, um, as you know, back home, they installed uh, the male um, rain queen uh-huh. or the rain king right uh-huh. now if we're actually going to follow traditions right it's not there's no problem about having a male rain king but if he wants to be the male rain king and it's a drought he must know what that means exactly it means that it's his head that needs to be chopped off his <laughs> blood needs to nourish the rains true seriously we need to sacrifice him so if this drought continues and we've got a male rain king he's he's going to be killed let's go for you it's hard man He's just, I get it, they've installed him. Yeah, Does he know that? Did. Does he know that? Did they tell sure. him that that's how it happens? <laughs> I'm not sure. They take him and then they lunk up the, the tallest. Mm-hmm. Yes. You know what, my man? You know what? Uh, I've spent the whole of two to three days just on every time when I search on Google, mm. Instagram, or like Nota, you know? Mm. And I must say, man, you're a genius. Bro. <laughs> Do you know that? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> what, what, you, what is okay? What is one subject or one topic that you don't know? That that you have to be like, ah, you know what, ah, guys, I guess in game. Like I'm not involved yet. I don't know, but like, uh, I can't. There must be. Now. There's many. There's so many. Really? There's so many. That's why I always hang out with people who know th- about things that I don't know anything about. What is it that you are you're learning now? This, like, hmm? what is it that you are learning now? Ah, dog. Every anything that I can. It, it, dog, it's the information age. So, uh, think about it like this. Let's say there's a guy with a billion, right? Uh-huh. There's a guy standing here. Now, now both of us meet him, mm-hmm. right? Who is he giving the billion to? The guy with more or less information. Yeah, the one with more information. So therefore, all you can do in your life is fill yourself up with as much information as possible so that in the chance of curious that you run into a billionaire, you've got m- more information than the nigga next to you. And and I want to ask you this, man. And maybe that, that that's one lesson that you could teach to people. How do you filter information? Because I would read a lot curate. of things and curate. Like you, you go into you 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 index. Uh-huh. You go through indexing. So it's like when you read the Bible. Yes. When you read the Bible, you don't read the Bible just by reading the Bible. You read like ish. Yeah, I'm going through this. So you go to the back of the Bible and it tells yeah. you, and then it says these are the chapters yeah. that talk about that, and you read same thing. Fuck. <sighs> Same thing. And the library, guys. People used to go to the library. So the thing is that my mother studied at IMM. My sister also studied varsity and all that stuff. So they'd go to the library. And now I'm a kid, ne? So I've got nothing to do in the library. Like I'm a kid. But I've got all these books and I can read. Hey. So I'm gonna read because like my mother's studying something that she's gonna fail at, but she can fail as many times as possible because my father pays for it anyway, so she doesn't give a damn. <laughs> so you'd go and read that. I, I'd read the textbooks. Hey. My mother has all the textbooks from all the subjects she failed. I studied all of them. <laughs> IMM, which one? Which one? I'm a marketing ma- which, maverick. Which one did I you? I studied IMM everything. <laughs> it the whole entire which one did she pass? You keep saying the ones that she fails. <laughs> she failed everything. <laughs> the only thing she fa- she passed was health and safety. Health and safety. Really? Yeah. That's what I do. That's my she got an really. M taken that. Really? Yeah, but now she's 65. She's retired. <laughs> 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 she's on pension. <laughs> you know, enjoying my dad's money. Yeah, no. So what was the use of that degree? And and I I, I saw one of your posts. You you posted soy soy in the morning. Yeah. And you were like, uh, no, forget soy. that, forget that. No, no, Wait, no, no, no. no, no. no. Before ah. you go there, but before you go to that post, you must yeah. understand that my Instagram profile picture is me and Sway. Sway in the me and Sway, my Instagram profile picture is me and Sway. It's yeah, been like that, that for yeah, a long yeah, time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, the reason I did yes, that is yes. to say Sway has the answers. Yes. 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 Because my name is Nshamolo. Nshamolo. I've been saying Sway had the answers. Yes. Before Kanye came back and admitted that Sway had the answers. That's what I want to ask. Sway got noted. In. He's got the answers. Hey. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> Do you feel like you have all the answers? Well, Sway knows I've got the answers. No, I'm, I'm talking about you. Sway knows I've got the answers. I want to ask you this question. I'm sure you're not going to get this one. Well, right. why, why did they call me Shamul if I don't have the answers? <laughs> so even if I don't have the answers, they knew that I'm the person who's going to go out there and find the answers, right? Wait, yeah. Either way. And, and, and when did you meet uh, uh, Sway? Um, or how did, you, how did you discover that he got answers? 
No, I knew. I knew what he was talking about. I knew what both. I could understand what the argument was that him and Kanye were having. Mm-hmm. I could understand what it was. I was having the same frustration at the same time. I was deciding whether we sign with Sony or we yeah. go independent. Yeah. And I was like, yo, we need to sign with Sony. What? You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Because at the time we're having this argument, and then now when we're gonna sign with Sony, what happens is that means it means that Sony is gonna make eighty percent of the money. Mm. From all this music that we're making, whether it's been good to spirit, all that stuff, they have got. They don't even contribute to the ideas of the songs. Nothing. And nothing. Fuck all. They don't pay for the video. Mm. They don't do they don't fuck do all. Nothing. nothing. All they do is put it in stores. Yeah. We make it hot. We do everything. We come up with the campaigns, everything, and they're gonna make eighty percent of the money. Crazy. Now I need to convince niggas that this is a good deal. Mm. How do I convince? Niggas that a, a bad deal is a good deal. I need to convince them that okay, it's fine. This is a bad deal now, but in ten years from now, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Yeah. Oh. Now you must remember that we're signing that deal. Kai, at that point in time, when the deal negotiation starts, the deal negotiation started immediately as, as Kai was born. So as soon as she was born, I was like, okay, fine. Now this needs to happen. So we we've got no time to waste. Mm-hmm. And whatever Bada Bing is doing, fuck them. Because now there's a baby, there's a there's a, yeah. there's a life child here yeah, that needs to be able to go to school at some point in time. Mm. I know that. Fine, if she's here now, we've got six years to ensure we can afford to, to take her to a private school. Yeah, you understand? That, that's it. So sharp, the clock is ticking now. Um, so now it's like, okay, fine. How do we get this? How do we get the most out of this deal? The only way to get the most out of this deal is to ensure that um, um, this deal were able to piggyback off of whatever momentum they already have. Mm-hmm. They just already, they just signed iFunny. Mm-hmm. And iFunny, they were picking up Steve because they were putting him up there. They were making sure his songs are on radio. So he's got radio playlisting and people are wondering, why is iFunny doing so well? It's because he's got a major label that's making sure that he's behind him. Polo Yam, Zunta, Tundibek. Not, this is after Airway and all of that shit. Uh. So yes. So uh. they made sure Sony, Sony, like Tuba Nilambo. Never. Um, seriously. Not right. at Sony yeah. or at, at any of these companies, but we took the L. So, you know, now looking at what Kanye is going through in, in that whole entire point in time, I knew that okay, one day we need to break out of this relationship. How this, is it? Yeah, you understand. So I decided that you know, um, think about it like this: anytime an artist leaves a label, uh-huh. right, when they want to start their own label, the best way to start it is to demonize the old label. Yes. So that their fans can abandon that label and, and move go to with the you. you understand? Whether yeah. or not that person did wrong, but you need to do that, otherwise your thing is not gonna be successful. Otherwise they're gonna say, Why are you leaving? Why are you leaving? Yeah. <laughs> because they're fine, they're taking care <laughs> yeah, of you. Yeah. Yeah. Why are you Why leaving? You leaving now? You understand yeah. what I'm saying? So you need to say I'm leaving because they did not pay me. Well. They, 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 <laughs> so all the stories that we hear sometimes yeah, they're not true. true. Dog, if they, if and Artis says to you, here's the invoice, my future. Yeah. Here's the emails. I've been asking for my money for months. Cra- yeah. That's, I can believe that one. Diddy was talking about it on The Breakfast Lab just recently. Yeah, that's what I was about saying. About Mace, yeah. yeah. Refer invoice. Invoice, yeah, he was talking about it. <laughs> Refer invoice, <laughs> brother. Refer invoice, dog. We've got money. Don't worry, we'll pay you. We'll pay you. <laughs> Give us the invoice, brother, with the details. <laughs> but it's crazy that you know most of the time they don't have that invoice. Where's the, so then, so the... So the thing is that you can use that on the fans who don't know anything. Yay. And now, now I'm an executive. I'm not a celebrity. <laughs> so when I go to Woolworths, but hey, when I tell it as hard. But for Lord. But for you, go Woolworths. <laughs> Give all my old lady. Imagine I'm with my old lady. Like, my old lady is like, hey, tell it as hard. <laughs> <laughs> Are, are you being DJ Spoon now? I'm just saying. Oh, okay. and now the <laughs> owner is asking me. Now I'm just like, no, mama, I didn't. Mama. Listen. One thing, mama. Ow, mama. mama. Kilo, kilo, like, so. Ow. <laughs> but she's Crazy. reading this. Ow, but she's reading this way. Crazy. In the newspapers. Yeah. And your mother, everything she's ever read in the newspaper, she's believed it. Now she's reading about you. So do you think she's going to stop believing it? Because <laughs> it's you. Mm. But, but, but don't you think there's some record labels that would do dirty to the artist? That's not the point. What I'm trying to say is this. If you're an artist and you're old money, show us the invoice, chief. Show us the paper trail. I get a Kanye when he complained about his record label. Yeah. He posted the contracts, didn't he? The contracts, yeah. And, 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 and on that contract, you, you put an analysis about that contract. And then they ban me from Twitter. They ban you from Twitter. And, and I want to ask you, do you think Kanye West or Jay-Z, they know you? No, Jay-Z knows me. Really? 
they banned me from Twitter because at the time I was working at Sony. Yeah. And the biggest artist at Sony is Beyonce. Weird. And Beyonce's husband is Jay Z. Mm-hmm. And I just exposed Jay Z. So what did Jay Z do? He called my bosses. And then they called me into a fucking Zoom meeting. So now I'm in a Zoom meeting because Jay Z is angry at me. Uh-huh. You know? So Jay Z doesn't own Rock Nation. He owns a part of Rock Nation. He owns shares in it. It's not, it's a, he's not the majority shareholder. Yeah. Beyonce. He doesn't control it. You understand? He can't give it to his baby. He can't give it to Blue and say, Blue, Blue this is Blue Nation. No. You know? The only Blue Nation is here in KZN. <laughs> and the only Ivy Son is Nasty C. <laughs> so Blue Ivy. A Zulu, a Zulu man with the power. Yeah. It's crazy. I, I so, saw, I, so, 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 yeah. you know, so now I'm in this meeting. I'm like, okay, cool. So obviously now I have to sign a whole lot of NDAs, contracts. You know yeah. what I mean? They're taking me through this whole entire thing. And I'm like... Hey man, it is what it is. Yeah, you know. Yes, so I'm like, they're like, I cool, but you know, there's going to have to be some serious consequences that you know. That's what they're telling you. Yeah, it's Jesus people. No, it's it's Sony. No, it's Sony. Yeah, oh, okay. it's my team. Oh, okay. yeah, it's my boss. But it was, in, it was in because of what you my said about the New York. contract. Yeah. Yes, 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 because I explained it to people. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because I broke it down to people. Hey. Yes, and very few people in the world actually have knowledge to read through contracts. I'm one of the best people that can actually understand what is going through contracts in South Africa. Mm. You know, I've got that knowledge. Like I'm number number one in South Africa when it comes to that knowledge. Number yeah. one, yeah. like in general. Yeah. So obviously, reading through that contract was very easy for me to understand, very quick. Well, what are you but working? I deal with contracts all the time. Yeah. Must, you know, the reason why I was I was working at Sony was I was I was I was opening up their distribution office in South Africa. Mm-hmm. So I was dealing with contracts every single day. So I know everything, the parameters of every deal. So I mean, I, I took it on the chain. I was like, yo, Jay needs to do what Jay needs to do to protect yes. what, what Jay's interests are. He's got Jack Dorsey at the time, who's mm-hmm. on the board of Twitter. This is before he gets shown yeah. off the board. And sure. they go, go into business deals. They're about to buy title. Yeah. So Jack Dorsey was about to buy title. And this was looking bad for his title it's deal because it's bad yeah. for Jay-Z's image. You know, as this guy who's trying to save the industry, trying to save artists, and then he sold Kanye's masters is, nah. just to get his own back. And he doesn't get his own back. In fact, he's waiting to get his own back. He's on a license as well. Mm-hmm. It's just that they changed the name of the company that puts um, the, 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 the registration on iTunes so that you can't see who owns the masters. But he's on a license as well. And he gets, he gets his masters back after 35 years, which is the law. The law yeah. is that after 35 years, the record company needs to give up their masters. Shaka Khan was gaining her masters back because it was 35 years that just expired mm-hmm. as well. You know what I mean? Aretha, not, it was Shaka Khan, eh? Shaka Khan. Yeah, who was yeah. crying about her masters and getting her masters back. Yeah, yeah so Jay-Z is going to get his masters back now in 2029. Mm-hmm. You know what? Let's pause. You see now they're calling me. Let's pause the, no. issue, the, the overseas issues. Wow. No, this is a local issue. <laughs> this is, a, this is a my issue. I'm talking about myself. It's not a, just because Don't now I'm in the conversation with exactly. Kanye, just because Kanye responds to my tweets, is now a <laughs> He's responding to a, your local bruise. Be, be, be proud of it. Was, a, a, you know, like, you know we, we've, got, we've got a genius in South Africa. Yes, that, you know, we can shake up the game. Even what Kanye can wow. even respond to him. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, be proud of that. I'm bro. proud of you, and I'm even sitting next to you. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And, I, and I'm proud of the fact that you pull up on us. Dog. And, and I, okay, but we'll get there. We'll get to Tukagi. Yeah, I <laughs> know, but I'm just saying, so now that was my situation. So yeah. I took that situation, and then I was like, okay, fine. But Sony said, yo, at the end of the day, it's not personal, it's, it's not business. Personal, yeah. So we'll take care of you. Don't worry. Clean. Yeah, so they took care of me. So, like, I've got no beef with Sony. I'm good. I'm nice. I'll help them. How did they take care help. of you? How? They pay me for my services. They take how long were you with me. them? How much money did I make for them? That's what you should be asking. Not how long was I with them. I told you that the deal that we signed makes 80% of the money for them and 20% for me. And, and, and if you just imagine. Money, okay, let's just say for estimate I made 5 million. How much did they make? Let's just say I made 5 million. How much did they make? Yeah, Four times that much. Yeah. So how much is that? My math is not good. Then. It's 20. <laughs> just think about that, Doc. Do you understand what I'm saying? Through you. Imagine. To make guy. You understand? Sitting next to you. You understand what I'm saying? So now imagine. What does it make me? It, 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 what do they owe me? <laughs> <laughs> Think about what they owe me, dog. They owe me everything, dog. Yeah. They owe me everything. The entire game who, owes who, who me. Owns you the entire, they, dog, let me tell you something about the game. The entire industry owes me. Let me tell you why. Because okay. na, in na, instead, of, instead of keeping the knowledge to myself and understanding of the business to yeah. myself, na, na, I plan like a mastermind. I planned because now I sat down. I sat down. I said I sat down with 
uh, Maporisa. And I say this all the time in podcasts, and people don't understand this. The reason why Maporisa is so far ahead of you guys is that Maporisa and I are on another level. We understand the game from yeah, you know. that other level. We were saying that yesterday. You guys are here. You you have not even an I you know, me and Pori, when we chat, you don't even see us. That's Kali. No, I don't need to. But you don't even see us. We, we, we don't even need, you need to see us. I, I don't need to call him. Yeah. I don't need to call him. But we we we, we know our game. Yeah. We I can say something and Pori can understand what I'm saying. Yeah. Without you guys understand what I'm saying. Yeah. And we'll understand it after three years. No, you'll never. <laughs> you'll never. Because we're talking amongst ourselves. It's our language. You yeah. understand what I'm saying? It's our language. And, 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 and talking about Mapurisa. So, hold on. You, you guys don't understand how Mapurisa got into um, uh, uh, Sony and, and that whole entire deal. It was a through pass. Yeah. It was a true pass. It's you, yeah. It was a true pass. You understand? It was a true pass yeah. from me because I said, Chief, these guys have made them so much money. And because I've made them so much money, this I've understood their system. This is how you can make a profit off of their system. Mm-hmm. So then he went to the other side. He went in and then he went to the other side to make money for Electro Mode, which is the enemy. Right? Yeah. Cool. And then I said, Chief, you're making too much money. These guys, there's no way they'll cut you off. You make too much money. They Hold out until they give you the proper settlement so that they can bring you onto their side because you'll make money for them. For them, yes. you're valuable. Mm. You understand? You know your value. You understand? So, Bona, they'll try to make it seem as if you don't know your value so they can get you for the cheapest price, for the yeah. uh, highest maximum price. And then, for that price, what you will then have a position to do is that you will then have the platform that decides who gets on and who doesn't. Mm. And because you are the one who decides who gets on and who doesn't through your platform, you are ensuring that the proper artist development goes into building up who gets on yeah. and who doesn't. Yeah. That's that's what you are able to do. Yeah. You understand? Everybody else, yes, Kanisa or whatever, or his name can come through, go on TikTok, have two million subscribers, have one hit song, sharp. That's not a career, dog. Mm. It's not a career. And a lot of these TikTok stars, like they get hot in the year, and in the, the year that you're hot, yes. You've been hot for one year, dog. Is that the reason why you said um, Demtuda's career? Demtuda doesn't have fans. Is that it is not the same as Gabriel Small? It's not. He does not have the mentorship from. He doesn't have Maporeza. Yeah. Yes, Maporeza is making sure that. But he's, he's nice. He's developed. No, he's not. He's not. He's not. He's not. His music is nice. Yeah. He's, yeah. I wanted to say yeah. I'm yeah. About that. But he doesn't have a nice. fan base. Yeah. So you need validation from Maporeza. No, you don't need validation. You need mentorship. You need grooming. How you build up your brand. So, mm-hmm. Cubs of the Small will do a Scorpion Kings. Now, Cubs of the Small, as an uh, up-and-coming artist, there's no way you can still Times Square Arena early one. But if he's doing it with a guy like Pori, who's been in the game, who's got the relationships, who can get you all the features because he's been in the game for 20 years, you are catching up. You are hot right now with your shit that you're doing right now, because right? yeah. it's in the moment. Yeah. But on top of the shit that you're doing right now, this guy's got 20 years experience in the game. And with that yeah, 20 years yeah. experience, if you come together with your hotness right now, yeah, yeah. you've got everything. Yeah. Undefeatable combo. Wow. So Why? Because as Gabs are you a new guy. You need um, Zonke on a song. Or you can call Zonke and bring him to the studio. You need Tandiswa Mazwai Something to come like through. Yeah. Or you will call Oskiro. Oskiro will make sure Tandiswa comes. Because uh-huh. Tandiswa is a diva. She's going to complain. Why must I come to the studio for these boys? Who's this fucking Gabs guy? Yeah. Why the fuck must I leave the, em- the, the, the empire where I'm sitting up there yeah. to come down to this lowly minion <laughs> comes at the small and sing in his fucking studio? What the fuck? <laughs> and then, so Oskido needs to now act here and beg her, please, Tandis, we are begging you, please, please, please. I'm Rapella, I'm Rapella, I'm Rapella. When are them two, can you get Tandis in studio? Never. Exactly. You, and that's the difference. And that's the difference. Frack, man. Crazy. I, I, I gave you just one example. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? And, uh, and that's how you move. That's how, that's, that's who you... you that's why I move. Yeah. That's why when people... I said that I tweeted the other day. I said my wife has spent more weeks on the chart at than, number one, than AKA and, and, and Zintle and, and Black, Black Motion, Motion combined. combined. <laughs> Fuck! I saw that too. Why? How's your how's your wife anyway? I don't know. Okay. Why do Why did you say that? How do you mean? It's true. It's fake. Oh. And and you said you said uh, AKA my, no, 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 hold on, hold on. My wife is good. She's well taken care of. You know <laughs> what I mean? If you teach a man to fish. You know, I taught my wife how to take care of herself because why? I don't want to have to take care of her. 
Because I want to be busy doing things like coming to you and your podcast and stuff like that. Wait, wait, you know what I'm saying? Wait, wait. Now Yana, she wants me to take photos for her TikToks. Imagine a whole entire authority, the mogul. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I now need to be shooting her TikToks. Just because do, she do, sings do, on the stage and she plays the guitar. Do you, do you still chat with her? Do you chat on a regular basis? No. I, if, no. You don't? Mm-mm. Ah, okay. Clean. I don't need to. But when she signs the form, she needs to sign married. She needs to sign my name. <laughs> <laughs> do you do that, you? I, I also have to sign, yes. I paid the calls for yeah. that. You know? I paid the calls for that. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. So, I'm fine. I was I'm listening. I was listening. I'm sorted. I'm not, yeah. I'm not ugly now. It's not like women don't like me. Women and don't and throw and themselves it, at me. I'm just saying. That's one of my questions. That's no, a, let's not go there. Uh, no, 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 Right, and you're a model, and you're mm-hmm. hot, and you're sexy, mm-hmm. and then I pop up on your IG, and you post me on your IG. You're famous. Yeah. All of a sudden, you're getting a bag. L'Oreal is calling you. Yo, why don't you do an influencer campaign for such and such and such and such and such? What do you think my wife got for being my wife? She got to the top of the charts because they're like, oh, that's that man's wife. But I think, I, I think, I think let's let's pass on your wife. She's your wife. And I'm, 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 I'm just, but I'm just saying, she got the ultimate. Yeah. You understand? They said, oh, let's put her on the board uh-huh. at whatever. Let's put her on the magazine I, covers at whatever. Because that's so and so's. You understand? You, you, you know, you know how, how vocal how vocal you are, like the things that you would they talk. Know I feel like ladies, they, ladies are scared of you. you know, not that I'm not sure, I'm sure your, your, your DM is not as busy as mine. I'm not going to play that game with you. I'm joking. <laughs> I'm not going to play that game with you. You don't have blue ticks in your DMs. <laughs> I'll leave that. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. Listen. So, I, I I can't play that game. Yeah, you yeah. can't. Mm-hmm. Let, 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 let's go back a bit to a uh, podcast. I feel like you are one of the most interviewed or podcast appearing person in South Africa at the moment. Thank you. Why is that, bro? Like, why did you decide on just? Because I say yes. Yeah. <laughs> And, you, and like you said, you're giving opportunities to us. Like, yes. I mean, no one would do that. Mm. Do you do you feel like uh, you're, 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 you're like a person that is writing a book about whatever the knowledge that they know? Do you feel like people learn through you going through uh, the podcast? Yeah, that's how I learned as well. I learned from other people that I watch on podcasts. Yeah. When Elon Musk is on the podcast, I watch it and I learn. Yeah. So then, if I hop on a podcast, people are gonna watch it and gonna learn. I saw one of your the, the interviews that you did. You like you listen to the podcast to listen to your voice so that you can improve on that. Do yeah, how I speak on yeah. podcasts because sometimes I don't even finish the words I'm saying. Sometimes I don't even finish the sentences because you know um, what happens when you don't speak to strangers a lot. You speak to people who are familiar with you. Yeah. So yeah. we don't even finish sentences anymore. Ah, oh, okay. We don't even explain things fully because we were there together. Yeah. So when we're explaining it, we're saying, remember, and then Atwara, and then, uh, oh, yeah. and then, <laughs> and then the person who's watching is like, what are these guys talking about? Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Sure. So understand. now we've got an audience, so I need to watch myself to see, oh, that's what I'm doing wrong. You know, like that's where I'm unclear. Yes. That's t- what I need to fix. T- I'm stuttering there. Yeah. yeah. That's it. But but you speak nicely, man. I know. You, you but even if I nicely. speak so nicely and I want to improve, it means that someone who's watching me thinks to themselves that this guy who I think so highly of is working on themselves. Yeah. After having achieved so much, <laughs> that means that I should never stop practicing. I don't stop practicing. As yeah. successful as I, I don't stop practicing. I don't. Shit, man. Like talking about the podcast, like I, you know, you know, rappers when they go to. You know what's the worst thing? No, no, no. I feel no. I, I just wanna say it. it's okay. like it's like it's like it's like it's like it's like. In my thing is that you can't retire. At least you saying Bolt could retire. Ne? Mm. He could retire. Ne? In my thing, I can't retire. So it's different. So you saying Bolt set the world record for the fastest hundred meters, right? Yeah. No one has beaten it since twenty twelve. Been ten years standing that record, right? Ten years standing, right? Uh-huh. It was set on the fifth of August, um, twenty twelve. So. That record has been standing yes. for 10 years and 3 months. Right. You understand what I'm saying? Uh-huh. For 10 years, okay, 10 years, 2 months. You know what I mean? You've been in a game for years. Uh, you understand what I'm saying? Enough, yeah. 
My records have been standing. But my thing is that in music, you can't retire. It can't be like, oh, Michael Jackson is dead. Nah. Uh-huh. He can't retire. Because they'll say, hey, Drake just broke Michael Jackson's record. It's like, but hold on, but Michael Jackson's been dead for so many years. So if you're saying Drake, how can, can just he... Just said, no. You know, he can't uh. break. Like, it's not like he was competing head to head with <laughs> Michael. But, but I want to ask you this. What's your record? Like, what's your record from your side? No, like, my record. Like, I've released my record label, my record company, you know, my, my company, the, the copyrights that we represent and own and control. Um, are the two top selling songs in South African music history. Mm. Which is in Yasfela Ngawe, over 2 million copies Oppressed sold, uh-huh. and uh, uh, Ngud, Ngud yeah. which is Ngud. over a million copies sold. Mm. Yeah. That's your record. Yeah. That's South Africa's record. Like, no one's beating that in South Africa. Brenda Farsi, what uh, you name them. Who are the, your legends? It's a pleasure. Who are your mother's <laughs> favorites? <laughs> Who are your mother's favorites? Name them. Pleasure. You know pleasure. You know pleasure. Yeah, he hasn't gotten to, he hasn't sold a million copies. <laughs> The only person who sold a million copies of anything is Lucky Dube. And he sold a million copies of an album. And that's the record that we're chasing right now. Nice. And we're almost there. We're almost there. No. Santa 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 is not, it's not an album. Stop it. <laughs> and you're not on the fucking microphone. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's the thing. You need to discipline your team. Yeah, no. Because a nigga can't come through with an incorrect thing mm-hmm. and then say it on the microphone, right? So you, we need to discipline the team. We need to make sure that this is a teachable moment. It needs to be a lesson. It's like, okay, so some guy came in, he said something, and then what did Nota say? He turned that into a content moment. Okay, mm. so sh- let me tell you something right. about Sete. Those are YouTube numbers, dog. Yeah. Okay, what Blackie's doing, sharp, great, dog. You ain't sold 80,000 albums. 80,000 albums at 60 rand a pop is a couple million rands that buys your house cash. You haven't seen millions of rands in your account at the same time. Mm. Now, none of you niggas with your streaming money have seen that. You haven't seen CD money, dog. Like, we come from a different era of money. Rebecca Malope type money. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. You kids haven't seen See, that shit. You guys are in the no, streaming era. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Like, what? <laughs> you understand? That's the reason why Bonota can relax for years. Ah. Chilling. So did, and come you, to the club. So you say you, you used to sell the CDs. You understand? We, we, we sold CDs. We sold. It, it was a CD era when we were selling those CDs. Dog. The, the cartoon sold CDs, dog. Yeah. Come on, we sold everything, dog. Those are double copy CDs. The, you, people bought them. Mm. You understand? In their thousands. You know. So. So that's that's your record. Like that's your record, then. dog. It's untouchable. <laughs> dog. You understand what I'm saying? So like. You know. So now everyone that's competing can't beat my records. So now I must be impressed that niggas who can't even beat me. But what, what was the I must now say, who's the best of niggas that can't beat me? I must say, nonsense, dog. Nah, you've passed that line. Like, you understand what I'm saying? Yes, back. Like, dog, none of them are doing that shit. Are you threatened that there would be someone that would... If uh, I was threatened, I wouldn't share my information. I'd mm. keep it top secret. I'm not threatened. I can give you, I can tell you how I did it. You can't do it. Yes. That's why I tell you niggas how I did it. Because I know you can't do it. I just tell and you how I did it so you know how it, it got done. Yeah. And, and, and what, what, why do you think that we, we can't do it? Is it because of the resource? You're not mean. Or like the influence that you mm-hmm. have? You're not mean. You're not willing to do what I'm willing to do. What is it that you can do? I'm, I'm willing to be disciplined. I'm willing to be dedicated. I'm willing, I'm willing to say to my wife, listen, if you think that I'm going to be heartbroken, because when I, you think that you must wear the pants in this household, mm. right? Then you got another thing coming. Go. See for yourself. Yeah. See for yourself. You'll see. I'm the authority. I'm the authority. Are you, are you with or without you. <laughs> with or without you. Are you, are you also the authority in that home? I'm the authority in this home. In this home, if Kali starts to up, if you don't want to follow my rules, you can go, young lady. That's the reason why you call this guy for talking on the mic. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what do you mean? You're not on the mic, dog. Uh, no. You're not on the stage. Exactly. You're not on the mic. Yeah. Please. Please. You know your role. Shut the fuck up. You know what I'm So now... You want to grab the steering wheel, get driver. You're going to kill us both. <laughs> get out. <laughs> Go. I'm not going to chase you. Wait. That's the thing. She, my wife thought she, I was going to chase her. She thought, yo, this man is going to run after me. Gonna chase. She thought it was a movie. Uh-huh. She thought she was going to meet with me at the airport. Got a fucking chance. Do you still nah, love I'll be me? chilling. You yes, of course I love my wife. I chose to love my wife. Dog. Yeah. I, wouldn't, I wouldn't give her the cows. I wouldn't give her the power, mm-hmm. you know, to have control over half my net worth if I didn't love her. Wait. You know? Um. Mm. 
but you know the, it comes at a price to be my wife you need to earn that right i was listening to p diddy was talking about that he will, he will never do a wedding you'll rather like do a ceremony to celebrate love yeah but yeah. that's the same thing I, like my wife wanted a wedding i was like you haven't even been married to me for how many years i said you need to be married to me for five years first <laughs> five years you need to earn your right you need to have swept you need to see the hard work your, your, your knees are too light-skinned you're yeah. too yellow bone here on the knees so yeah. So we need the darkness here. Must be <laughs> black. Uh, then, yeah. 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 That's what we need. And then yeah, then you can have the, the wedding of your dreams. Yeah. Uh, in a nice white dress to cover those dark knees. Man, talking about the podcast and you visiting the podcast. What are your I, I know they normally would ask the rappers in their top five. What are your top five? No, man, I, I know man. Uh, there's no such thing. There's no top five. Until we've got a thousand podcasts that are hot, we can't have a top five. So yeah. let's get to a thousand hot podcasts first. Just get to a thousand. But, uh, but let's talk about the one that you fuck with now, the one that you like now. I don't fuck with any of them. I normally see you on. I don't fuck with any of them. Nah, you do. You know nah. what? In, in each and every premiere of, uh, what do you call it? The, 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 the boys? Which one? Everything SMZ? Yeah. You're always there. The premiere. Mm, I'm supporting them. Yeah. I'm making people support them. Really? Because if I'm there, I've got an authoritative voice. Because I know these other celebrity rappers and everything else, they'll use them, but they won't support them. They won't endorse True. them. True. You mm. understand? But they don't need those rappers because I'm more famous than all those rappers. Mm. You understand? There isn't an SEC fan that doesn't know me. There isn't an AJA fan that doesn't know me. There isn't a Casper fan that doesn't know me. There isn't a Big mm. Zulu fan that doesn't know me. Yeah. Name a rapper, Nast- their fan Nast- base Nast- knows Nast- me. Nastasi has been overseas. At doesn't matter. Time. Probably he has friends there. And they know me. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> sure. They know me. Yeah. You understand? That's the thing. That's why his fans need to say, yeah, this nigga was rapping about you on this song. Yeah. And he tagged me. If your favorite rappers, if KO has to write a rap, and then his fans have to say, yeah, this one was for you. How famous am I? Mm. Damn it. You understand what I'm saying? Now when I go to the club and they play that song, they talk about me on the song that's playing in the club. What are the bitches thinking? You can pop 20 bottles. Yeah. They all want to fuck me. Ah! Oh. Po, 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 po. But you said you don't fuck. Uh, so that's exactly. You, you I, went to, I went. To, I went. To, I went to a major league gig. I went there. I saw my boys there. They were young guys. Uh. About DJ Yams, whatever. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Well, he's Yams. He's, he's a producer, not, but was DJing that night. Yeah. <laughs> so I bought a bottle, and then clean. All of a sudden, the table starts getting full and everything. So I was like, I know, boys, let me go. Yeah. Like, oh, the bottle just arrived. Why are you leaving? I said, boys, if I don't leave. Y'all niggas ain't fucking. Really? Because I'm here? Yes. Because yeah. all these bitches are going to want to fuck me, right? So they're not going to want to know that they fucked one of these niggas. You know what? You understand what I'm saying? No, so, <laughs> uh, so if I don't leave, I don't no, like, 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 <laughs> and I know I bought this bottle, niggas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, but uh, if I don't, don't leave, y'all yeah, niggas won't smash. How? They wanna, the bitches are going to want to smash Murepi. Ah no no chat. Now I feel like ladies are scared of you, bro. I was talking to I was talking to a couple of ladies that I'm going to interview. Dog. You. Ladies, like, hold on, ladies, no, ladies, 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 go to prisons, marry niggas who are behind bars, write books about them. Yeah, niggas who are killers, murderers. Ladies are not scared of any nigga, dog. But but let me tell you something. The biggest serial killer in the world. There's a woman out there that thinks that their pussy can tame yeah. them. But, but, but those guys, they don't talk about ladies the way you talk about them. What I mean, you like mean? you said, you, ju- you just recently said you don't fuck ladies for 150. Imagine putting your dick in a, in a, in a, in a, in a lady for like 350. What is that? No, not 150, I mean to say. No, I'm talking about those days just so on the timeline. <laughs> You know the ones on Twitter. Yeah. Yo, they sell but pictures you, you of their toes. You also spoken about no, the, 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 the ones that, that, are, that are working in the club. Also them. With, with their champagnes and all. And it's work, bruh. No, no, no. The no, ones no. that are different. No, no, no. Working there, no, no. There's a different. I was there's ahead a different, when I... There's a different. There's a different. Hold on. If, you, if you're going to smash a club girl, right? Yeah. you got to be breaking your virginity. Seriously. you got to be the first nigga I'm saying. Like, if you're going to. If you're going to. you got to be the first nigga that's smashing. Number one. Otherwise, why would you do that? Why would you enter the life? I don't know, but okay. Yeah, no, 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 rather no, no, no. go to the to the the, the library and find yourself a nice girl who hasn't been through the whole entire squad. Yeah. Because like it, the whole goal for me, like when I was younger and smashing girls, 
was that I was trying to break their virginity. I wasn't trying to smash girls that other niggas had smashed. Now, the mentality with niggas right now, especially with celebrity culture, uh, they want to smash the hotspot. Yeah, they would go to ladies that have been around. That, you know, mm. oh, hey, hey Quick I, I want to add myself to that list. Yeah. Now you are adding value to the hoes. You're making the hoes have value. Mm. The hoes have no value. Because the value is virginity. <laughs> Once you break the virginity, you've taken all the value. There isn't a, there isn't a girl you saying if you there isn't a girl whose virginity you've broken that you cannot always fuck for the rest of your life. Ah, they move on, but these days never. Ah, they move on. No, it Maybe. means that you fall me off. You. No, me and no, no. you. No, no, me and you fall from off. the no, no. 90s. It means no, 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 As long as you are richer and more powerful than the man she's with right now, she will always fuck you. Yeah, but you are richer now. We're I've not talking. Been. I, it doesn't matter. When I was in high school, wait, but, wait, but wait, like, wait. When I was in high school, ne, uh-huh. my dad had money, right? But I had my own business. The other kids, yeah. they had their parents' money. I had my own money. Yes. yes. Difference. Yes. Difference. Yes. You understand? So when I was in high school, I was the richest nigga. Hold on. In my high school, not because I had the richest parents, because I had my own money. Wait, I yeah. could control my money. Mm-hmm. As in, dog, I would come to high school having flown in from Durban because I could book myself a flight and my parents couldn't stop me. Wait, yes. You, you can't stop me. I, I just come from Durban right now. I, came, I got to school right after first break. I'm going to class in my school uniform. Why? Because I booked my own flight. The, the, you can't stop a nigga. Dog, let's say my dad tries to stop me. I've got 40,000 rands right now in cash on me. Ooh. In 2007. Brian. You understand what I'm saying? My dad wanted me to go on holiday with the family. I had a gig. I didn't go on holiday with the family. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. My, my little brother went there with my aunt and everything else. I went there three days later. When I got to the holiday place, I look at the holiday place, I look at my aunt, I'm like, yo, guys, I'm slumming it like this. I told my little brother, I threw some cash, I threw 10K on the, on the bed. I said, clean, we're going to go shopping tomorrow. I said, we're going to a f- five-star place. Wait. We're leaving this place. So we left my aunt there <laughs> with my cousins. Yeah. And me and my little brother went, and then guess what's the problem? We're under 18. We've got all the money in the world, but we can't go into a we fucking go. nightclub. Oh. Fuck! Hey! Hey! No <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, fuck. All the money that you can talk about. <laughs> fuck! <laughs> and at, at what age did you start making money? Dog, I'm making money from when? Like, okay, I started business when I was 14, but I probably started making money when I was 16. 16, 17. You know, you know, you know if I must tell you, I think mm. we grow up in the same era, me and mm. you, Nev. I'm a 1990. I'm 91. Okay, good. But I think 20, 20 March. Yeah, 20 27, 27 okay, March. Nice. Yeah. So, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Mm, exactly. So, as I was listening to you, and one thing that I'm mad at myself is that I used to listen to hip hop. Like, I'm from the same era. And, and you used to listen to what the niggas are saying and you didn't do it. Fuck! <laughs> I Fuck! And then I did it. I was like, oh shit, okay. Hi, let me try this shit. I, you know what I mean? That, that, that's one thing that makes me angry, so you were bro. In the popo. I was here. I was actually <laughs> I'm serious. I was in the real north. <laughs> you were in the true north. <laughs> There's a difference between the real north and the true north. <laughs> but I was in the north, the deep down of it. Do you understand? I, I used to wait for Let me tell you something about the north. I the true to... north, right? Yeah, the, yeah. the most famous street is Bryanston Drive in Bryanston. Yeah. At the top of Bryanston Drive lives Dr. Menga. A Tonga man. Mm. Now that's what should tell you anything you need to know about the North. Exactly. His wife is. I don't know. The Princess of Africa. Fuck. Yes. Mummy Von Chuck. Oh, that Jesus. should tell you everything you need to know about at the top of Bryanston Drive. Uh-huh. And then at the bottom of Bryanston Drive, in the second last house yeah. on Bryanston Drive. The last house on Bryanston Drive mm-hmm. is number 315. The second last house is number 313. And that is the residence of Leslie Mampe. The alias. The alias. You understand? <laughs> so, the doctor that gave me my immunization as a kid and everything else, Dr. Minga, is at the top of Bryanston Drive. And the guy whose first album I launched is at the bottom of Bryanston Drive. Wait. Wait. Fuck. So, from Dr. Minga to the alias, Josie, the Mummy Von Chaka Chaka, mm. my musical connection is inside there. And then, uh, I used to play soccer with Longo Tala and and his brothers. Child. Yeah, he used oh, to play okay. soccer with them. Yeah. Scarlett Tinder was our coach. We used to play for a soccer team called... Did you used to play soccer? I didn't see you Yeah, I played soccer. soccer. I played soccer at an amateur level. Yeah. I played with the Stanley twins, Neil and Ivan. Yeah. Yeah. They used to practice with us as kids. They used to train us. Oh. Mm. So, you, so, you're talking... Scarlett Tinder. 
The Kaiser Chiefs legend, yes. That's Los Karagobe. Skara Tintwa. Skara Ngobe. Skara Ngobe is dead. <laughs> yeah, I do. He's not a legend. He's not. He's, 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 he's a late player. He died. He didn't become a legend. Like, you know, he, he, he died. He was Why nice. he, he, he was you know, nice. He man. was nice. That's the thing. But yeah. he didn't have the discipline. Yeah. If you don't have the discipline, you're out there smashing every girl because now you're on Kaiser Chiefs. You smash every girl. You're smashing the 150 girls. Mm. 150 girls. You'll sign up to a lifetime subscription. I was telling someone today, what's the biggest lifetime subscription in the in, in South Africa right now? Babies. ARVs. Ah. Think about yeah. it. Yeah. It's, it's the number one, the most subscribed to thing is ARVs. People who are on ARVs, it's an ARV program. I don't know how many people there is. 15 million people that are on an ARV program currently. Mm. They get pills every single month. As a subscription no. program. It's given. Like on this, it's on this day. Given. The government on pays day, for it. Yeah, on this As day, you must tax, come. The 5% of the population that pays tax <laughs> for the rest of the 95% to get all the services. I mean, what, talking about government, why are you so hard on the uh, police, bro? No, I'm hard on the, the, those police officers that do wrong. Yeah. The, those police officers that came and arrested me in my own complex yeah. that it committed a crime. And that even the one that me. met you, it doesn't like matter. All of them. Yeah. The, there wasn't one cop who came to me and apologized for what those cops did. Yeah. There wasn't one, and all of them wear the same fucking uniform. You understand? Mm-hmm. So therefore, those ones that did what they did to me represented every single motherfucker that I see in blue, and every single motherfucker that I see in blue is on site. And the thing is this: when you bump into me, you know who the fuck I am. South Africa doesn't know who the fuck you are. Mm. When I put you on my timeline, they're gonna know who the fuck you are. Please. For the scumbag that you are. You understand what I'm saying? Mm. And I'm not George Floyd. I'm not just some motherfucker you can put a knee on and some, nothing's gonna happen. You understand what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah. Now, you will live in hell. If you touch me, you do anything to me, you will live in hell for the rest of your life. I'm not saying to me, I don't come from a family that can't do anything. I don't need every forum to come for me. Uh, you understand what I'm saying? True. I've got each and every single resource possible to ensure. That if anything were to ever happen to me, every single generation that has your name attached to it, your bloodline. Is destroyed. Dude, we're not playing those games. We, we, we don't play those games. You understand? That's why them niggas knew. Let, let him go. They had to let him go. Do, 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 they, they haven't touched me. They haven't said anything. They know. Do they know you? Yes. They they know, they know you? you know me, dog. I know. So, are you telling me that the, the Metro Cops who get paid nice salaries don't have iPhones, don't have TikTok? But do you know... Do, they, do they don't have family members do, do who they, uh, watch my content when they come into the house and then they will see me on the YouTube screen. Yeah, but, but I know that they know you, but do they, they, all do, know they me. do they know the kind of influence that Dude, you have? Let me tell you something. When a cop is shot in a video, right, and the cop is drunk and whatever, uh, right, that video goes viral. Every yes. single cop sees that viral yes. because they're cops. They're going to yes. be interested in seeing what another cop did. Yeah. When I go out there and I've got a video with the cops, every single cop is going to see that video. True. True. Up to the minister of police. Then you're fucked. I'm not fucked. No, I'm saying the police. No, I'm not fucked. No, I'm saying the policeman. Yeah, because he doesn't know how far up we stretch. Yeah. You don't know. You don't know who our fathers or our father's brothers-in-law or whoever are up there. Did you None know your bosses? When you were young, did you know that you're gonna be this kind of a person? Yes, like I was with told. influence. Yes, I was told. Fuck. So I needed to be trained. I needed to be, you know, I needed to be told. Okay, when you've got this much influence and you've got this much power, you know, because I knew that when thing I say things, it's very powerful. Mm. You know, I've always known that. So I needed to be very careful with that power. I can mislead people. I can make people do the, the wrong things. So I've never led anyone the wrong way. There's no one that you've seen doing a wrong thing that was led there by me. Yeah. Yeah. And that's it. That's that's all you need to. If if people are out there doing crime and whatever, you know they weren't led by me. Oh. But if people are doing successful things, raising their families, you know, taking themselves out of poverty, that's you. Then. That's me, dog. And that's what you believe. You understand? In. That's it. My work Man. speaks for itself, dog. Man, crazy, crazy. Yeah. Well, <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't say crazy. <laughs> Isn't it? <laughs> but but you know what? I, I, let me take let me take it back a little bit. Now. I've watched a couple of your interviews on a lot of co- podcasts, now. but I never got to get the educational background. I mean, after the trip, where did you go? Nothing. Nothing. I went to UJ and then I dropped out because I was too busy. Then oh, UJ, what did you what did you register for? Uh, entrepreneurship management. Entrepreneurship management. Yeah, it was the first it's year. APK. When was it? Twenty Two thousand nine. Yeah, that was the year yeah. it was introduced. It was wow. the year it was introduced. And then I was like, no fucking way. So 
fine. I can just read the. How long were you there? Uh, I did it for like maybe six months. I I, I sent the letter in August because that's when I needed to. Yeah. Yeah. But, but, but at that time, were you, were you into this entertainment and industry? I was ready, dog. I was told you, I was, since I was 14. So yeah. I was already, I'd already been in. I'd already been an entrepreneur before I studied it. I'd already been making money. So now I'm going to be listening to a lecturer <laughs> who's wearing clothes from gay. If I... I mean... I don't... <laughs> Why is it a game, <laughs> You know, the only brand that game has is high tech. Mm. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, that's the only thing that is high tech. It's high tech or something else that you don't know. Mm. You know what I mean? That's it. Now I must talk about this guy's gonna teach me entrepreneurship. Yeah. <laughs> but that's you you I'm me. doing it. Yeah. I'm an entrepreneur. And, and, and I, I, I saw one of your interviews. And then after that, hold on, I went to Vega to do brand building. Vega? Okay. Mm. Brand building. Mm. Oh, okay. BBM. I went to study BBM. And then also, I dropped off after six months as well. And, and then after that, I went to IMM on my own. Now, I registered with my own money uh-huh. the third time. Because, yeah, the first time I was doing with my dad's money. Uh, and so, he was like, nah, yeah. no more. So apart from Sony, like, you've never been in corporate like. No, I worked for Sony for two years, though. Yeah. You, you would regard that as, as being in corporate? Dog, I started corporate as a director. Because <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm that guy. Ah, no, Because they hired me. I've been in corporate for 10 years exactly. now. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. <laughs> I started corporate as a director. I, st- I started as a director. The first black director at Sony. That's history, dog. And so is it Sony Africa? So it's it's Sony Music Africa. I'm the yeah. first black director there ever. Youngest. At 29, dog. 29? I wasn't even 29 when they, when they headhunted me. I was 28. Yeah. So, 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 so uh, obviously, uh, at the age of uh, 2009, 2018, you had around your 20s. It was 19. Twi- 19 tw- I was on tour so, with Soda so, Camp. So what, so what did and you... And TKZ. Uh-huh. And so Josie. And WHP wasn't coming to the shows. But I was on tour with them. How did, how did you how did you meet there? I was I was I was. I, but you from the north, now, probably you know. Uh, no, nah, I I gave them beats. I made beats uh-huh. for Sugar Smacks. I made his first single. Do you still make beats now? No, yeah. I, I quit a long time ago. Uh-huh. Yeah, I didn't have time. To what, make beats. When are we releasing uh, uh, an album like that? Uh-huh. Uh, Nota, what do you call it? Your first album that you have never released. Nah. Note to Nota. No, it's it's called the, the album of Nota. The album of Nota. Nah. Yes. I don't need to. I've released so many albums, dog. Mm. Why would I need to release my own album? I don't need to. The last album I released was Wanna dog. My wife's album. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, Wanna Sama, dog. Like, come on, dog. Uh huh. What must I do? Must I now win my 12th, 13th, 15th Sama for you guys? Uh-huh. So that you can say, yeah, you've got 15 Samas, but you don't have 16. <laughs> Because <laughs> that, uh, that's what you guys want now. <laughs> that's what, I mean, I've done things that none of y'all motherfuckers, uh, none of y'all have got sold the records I've sold. None mm-hmm. of y'all won the awards that I won. Mm-hmm. And, and, and y'all still think I haven't done enough. I still need to prove something to y'all motherfuckers who haven't done what I've done. Yeah. No, fuck you. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm not in that race. You're no, not. I'd, I, I'd rather spend my time going to these podcasts. Chatting yeah. to niggas, having nice conversations. You know, it is what it is. It is what it is. I, I, I saw uh, you spoken about Mensa Main, like mm. you were with him like the whole time when he was here. He's well, no, I've been hanging him. around, yeah. I've been hanging, I've been hanging around with him. You, you even mentioned the fact that... Uh, I've been showing him around town. Yeah, he made you uh, fall in love again with or have the energy back of showing a person around, like an artist around and all those things. Are you still on that, like? No. It's just reminiscent, dog. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? It's like when you go to your old high school and then you play on those on the field. Do you want to go back to high school? Nah, nah. Exactly. Nah, but you're saying no. no. But, but when life deal with me, I sometimes wish I would go back. Like, I would do, yeah. better. I would do better, maybe. No. But I fuck high school. I don't want to go there. 
We don't but, but it seems like you had a great time with him when he was here. What I'm trying to say is that me reminiscing about something. Yeah. And appreciating it. Doesn't mean that now I wanna go back. Ah. Okay. I was just enjoying it. I was like, yo, you know what I mean? That's it. Mm. That's what it was. Oh. You know? That that's what it is. Did did you did you get did you get hold of you? Did you reach out to you to say? No, I I got hold of him. Oh. Mm. I, I went to Cape Town and then I I linked up with him. How is he? Like, is he a, he's a nice guy? Eh? Mm, he's a chill guy. He's a chill he's guy. Chill. He's chill. He's an American. Yeah. I yeah. So I understand Americans. I don't I, I don't really fuck with South Africans that much. But. South Africans are too slow. <laughs> they're too lazy. They, they've got you know they got they got small hearts. They take offense to everything. They get angry. Yeah. About, you know, they feel inferior. You can't even joke with South Africans. But now you can't. You can't. You can't. They take it personal. You always have to be careful. Yo, you have to, uh, uh, you understand yeah. what I'm saying? So yeah. it's like, yo, it's boring. Nah. And this is Americans, you know, we're moving. We're moving, we're bro. We're getting done, chief. You know? Hey, man. You know, like, talking about um, South African music, yeah. mm. South African music and hip-hop, you normally say uh, you're the one that drove, like, you're the one that had like the whole movement of hip hop, like especially as a hip hop, mm. you hold it down for some time. And I want to ask you by myself, you, dog. Yeah, but let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. No, 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 Mm. Squatter Camp wasn't licensed to Gallo. They were signed they were to signed. Gallo. Yeah. I was licensed to Sony. Sony was taking instructions from me, from a little kid who was saying, This is the, our strategy. This is what we're doing. This is what we're doing. This is our direction. Mm. And then I broke all the, their sales records and I broke the industry's industry. sales records, which means I made the most money for any label and I made it for them. They were the ones who benefited. Uh-huh. You understand? The most from my genius. I'm sure Slicker will disagree with that. It, it doesn't matter whether he agrees or not. He hasn't sold the records I've sold. Mm. You understand what I'm saying? He, he, he doesn't get the views. No one listens to Slicker, dog. <laughs> no one. Nobody listens to Slicker, dog. You don't see videos on TikTok uh, of Slicker talking the whole entire time. You don't. You see videos but he of does me, not, dog. He does not go to a lot of It's podcasts. not about that. He's got a, a whole entire YouTube channel, dog. Yeah. You, you understand? When I go to your podcast, which has got 400 subscribers, I get more views than someone who goes on Slicker's channel. Please. I'm just saying. <laughs> Think about it. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. I come to your platform clean. I give you 10k guaranteed. Mm. You, you at least know. Okay, Nota's gonna give me that 10k. I'm gonna get that monetization. I'm gonna be able to move up my business and stuff like that and move. Done. That's it. If that's what you needed me for, that's what you needed me for. Go. Yeah. Now make me proud. Succeed. Be consistent. Yeah. Don't let me down. Don't let it be a waste. Cause now if I gave you that 10k views and that's your last 10k. It's on you, dog. I did yeah. my part, dog. Yeah, wait. You know, you know what I mean. I did my part. Hey, man. I, that's that's a pressure there. That's a pressure. But you know what? Talking about uh, um, Squatter Camp, now. Hmm. I've I've recently watched the podcast and chill and they were interviewing the girlfriend Cindy. Is it Cindy way? Of and and what did Squatter Camp do? Did, no, no, I'm saying the girl. And what did Squatter Camp do? No, no, but there was. Far what did Squatter Camp do? Do in terms of. After that girl did that to their homie. I don't know. Fuck off. Oh, yeah. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. That tells you. Squad, I, in my first interview, I said Squad Camp ain't solid. That's, That's the so first thing I learned. They're not yeah. solid. Them niggas is bitches. They're pussies as a group. As a squad, they're pussies. Mm. You understand what I'm saying? The niggas that founded you are dead. Squad Camp was founded by Nish yeah. and Flaba. And Flaba. And these niggas treated Nish's brother, who was the first manager of Squad Camp, like he's a bitch, like a piece of shit. Mm. I watched Slicker. I watched him. I watched how he treated um, Thingmajig, Smoo. I watched him. I watched him. It disgusted me. It disgusted me. It repulsed me. I was like, that's how you treat people that you think that offer you nothing. And that's why he thinks he can talk shit about me. Because he thinks that I offer him nothing. He doesn't know that I'm much smarter than anything he's ever done, dude. Everything that he's doing in his business is because I gave it to him already. You understand what I'm saying? He's following my fucking blueprints. He's not, he's not innovated beyond anything I've given him. You yeah. understand? And I'm far, so far beyond that. I'm so far beyond that, dog. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? I'm okay. so far beyond that. The thing is that he needed to make Slicker on Life something and use his personal brand to make it something. I made Nota something. 
from nothing. I didn't need squatter camp to do it. I didn't need any of those. Nah. Why? Because what's between my ears is more valuable than what's coming out your mouth. Right. That's it. Right. That's it. I, unfortunately, you know, that's what you have to contend with. You can't compete against this nigga. He's so much better, bigger than you. This is what I was saying to you earlier. You cancel Will Smith, right? And yes. you watch who's going to come to your motherfucking cinema. Never. We're not coming there to watch Chris Rock, motherfucker. <laughs> I don't care how many jokes he tells. Yeah. So you take Will Smith out of the cinema, you might as well close the fucking cinema, dog. Crazy. Seriously. That's what you need to do. I'm, I'm, I'm just saying. You understand yeah. what I'm saying? So yeah. you take Nota out of the industry, you might as well close the fucking industry. Ah, you say Nota is an industry. I am the industry. Think about it, dog. Sorry, you did, dog. Think about it, dog. All the people that are the most successful in the game all take instruction from me. Do you do you, do you normally would give like all of them? Do you normally would give like a a, a Mac G a credit because I think a lot of people they started. I don't give him credit no, for no, no, fuck no, no, I don't no, give him credit for what I'm saying is no, that a lot of people started knowing you. No, I don't give him credit for fuck off. No, I don't give him credit for fuck off. Ah. Because I could have gone onto any podcast and still done that shit. Because I do that. It to was the, the day. one that was dominating. It was the only one at the time. It was the earliest one. Yes. And and the reason why it was dominating because I helped it dominate. I, when I went onto that platform, I brought money onto that platform. I brought sponsors onto that platform. I brought resources onto that platform. Mm. You understand? I brought YouTube to support that platform. Right. You understand what I'm saying? I didn't just. The reason why I invited him to the 100k plaque presentation, Questa's plaque, is because YouTube was doing a plaque presentation for Questa. YouTube didn't send Questa his plaque. Oh. They did an event. A whole entire motherfucking event. To present it. As I'm sitting there with the YouTube team. You understand? The person who decides who gets black voices checks at YouTube is in the car asking, uh, in my car, where no one is allowed to smoke a cigarette, but she's allowed to smoke. In your car. You understand what I'm saying? So if I allow this woman to smoke in my car, what level do you think she's at? Fuck. Because no one smokes in my car. Mm. You understand what I'm saying? So I allow her to smoke in my car. You're welcome to smoke in my car. Lin, there's this other podcast that McG is about to be the biggest thing. He's going to be your biggest moneymaker. He's going to make sure that YouTube kills everything. That's what you're saying? Yes, I put him on. I identify the talent. I put him onto the platform. And then they use him as their flagship star. Yeah. That's it. And it worked. They chose a couple of different flagship stars, but he's the one, the one that I recommended is the one that shot through the roof. So what does that mean? It means that Nota knows what he's talking about. Why? Because he gives the opportunity to the person who's deserving of the opportunity, not the person who's going to benefit him. Mm. He gives the opportunity to the person who's deserving of the opportunity, not the person who's going to benefit him. Black Coffee gives the opportunity to DJ Tira because DJ Tira is going to benefit him. He doesn't give it to DJ Lag who deserves the opportunity yeah. and therefore Pharrell doesn't make a Grom classic that it becomes an international success and then Grom, the genre, dies yeah. out because it doesn't escape outside of South African borders. Wait. Because Black Coffee blocked it. Why? Because he thought it was going to compete against his Afrotech movement and everything else so he wanted to sabotage it in some way. He could not do that with Amapiano. Why? Because Amapiano has opened up a channel that he doesn't have which is TikTok. Yeah. You understand? And TikTok opened up those floodgates and it was over. There was no way Black Coffee was going to gatekeep that. Never. You understand? Mm-hmm. Fuck. That's it. That's too much. And then what do you do? You That's reduce too. Black Coffee and then you make the gatekeeper of South African music, you make it Maporisa. Ah, and now you make sure that Maporisa doesn't have to chop Black Coffee down to size. You do it for him. Mm. You don't fight with Maporisa. You've never seen no time Maporisa fighting. Yeah. But trust me, anyone who's ever fought Maporisa or Gabza or whatever, you notice know, chop them down to size. Mm. Universal Music gets a promo team to now tweet and compare them Twitter and Gabza. And now you guys now are starting to compare Twitter. You don't know that there's Twitter promo. Hey, yeah, I, 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 yeah. I'm Team Gabza. I'm Team. It's a promo. It's oh. just being done and they just do it every day and you don't see it. And then I tweet about it and then it stops. And then it never happens ever again. It's Chris Excel that did that. Why? <laughs> you share it. Why? Why? <laughs> Why? Fuck. Why? Why? Because they're changing the narrative. Mm. They want to now make it seem as if them Tuda and Gabs are on the same level. They're not on the same fucking level, dog. They're not. They're not on the same level, dog. You understand? Yeah. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't play like that. Don't play like that. We give the opportunity to the one who's deserving. You understand? Um, Seriously. Do you, do you, do you, there's, a, do you a, there's a company There's a company that wanted to give my police 300,000 rand for some deal. I said, fuck you. I called police manager. I said, charge them a meter. They'll give it to you. Sure. Yeah. That's it. I didn't charge a percentage. I didn't whatever. But Porisa's manager called that person. And then after she called that person, she got a meter. And then she called Pori. And then said, I got a meter from those people that were offering 300,000. Now, mm. how does she look? She looks good. 
She's just fine. You understand what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Now what does she think of me? No, anytime I need help, I'll call him. Hello, I you. Done. Yeah. Simple. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Reference, bro. It's very simple. Very simple. You understand what I'm saying? When Big Zulu is doing his whatever, uh, imalining or whatever, and then clean, hey, they're not paying Ricky, they're not paying in WZ to buy. I make the phone call, I say, clean, I ask the boys, Ricky, what do you want? Ricky says, ah, it's fine, Mina, leave me out of the money. Mm. He knows he's not going to claim it as a ghost. He's not going to live long anyway. But in WZ to buy needs the money. Okay, in WZ to buy, make sure, and then I make sure that in WZ to buy gets his money, ambitious gets their money, and everybody's straight up. And then what does Big Zulu do? Oh, it's Pugu Pugu. If Big Zulu was going to do anything to me, he would have done it already, nigga. He knows where I am. He knows where I am. He can't touch me, dog. He, he can pull up anyway. He, he can do whatever, dog. Come on. But I, I, are you not scared of... He, you not why scared of, why you, would I be you scared not, of him? Are you not scared of Big Zulu? Why, dog? He's got bills to pay. Yo, he's got a life to live. He's got bills to pay. He can't be going around making threats of violence upon anybody. Yeah. That's the end of his career, dog. How do you feel about that? I'm uh, just saying, he that, knows that. that. He's this right. This, uh, uh, he was doing it for you know what he was doing it for you yeah. guys saw that what he was doing it for he apologized yeah, yeah. afterwards so now what must i feel <laughs> at the end of the song he the apologized the records in the studio i paid for fuck come on dog you the little lord my god yeah, yeah, yeah. You're the little come lord. on dog <laughs> no i'm the overlord Over. oh fuck that's a new one there I'm the overlord. Put it, put it, put yeah, I'm on top of the landlords. Hey, you understand? Yeah. I pay the landlords. Hey. Yes. When his landlord needs money, he needs to call Papa. <laughs> I'm his grandfather. But but Nota, did you think you got a like did you did you strategize? Did you plan this thing? Yes, that's did why you, I kept quiet. Did you plan yes, that you're gonna keep quiet? That's why ah. I kept quiet. I saw these niggas. <laughs> I saw these niggas. There, there was a time where I was at in Durban and aka refused to greet me that day. I said, I said, why is this guy acting like this? Like life is not long. Does not know that I'm richer than him. And you, you, you were saying he, uh, lemonade is not making the numbers. No, it's the, it, and it didn't. It's not that he didn't manipulate the charts. They didn't manipulate the charts. Uh. Yes, they knew. They knew. I, I, I called it. I told them it's gonna take them three weeks. It's gonna take. It took them how many days? Five days to get to one million. Yeah. And then it takes them nineteen days to get to two. <laughs> so it, it tell me it takes fourteen more days. I told you it's gonna take three weeks. You understand? Yeah. And, and when is it gonna get to two point five million now? Never. <laughs> By the time t- Sete gets to twelve point five, because Sete is moving organically. Would you say uh, Sete is the biggest song, like in South Africa, like this year? Yes, this year. No, no, no. It's the second. Which one is the biggest? Paris. Paris. Which one is that Paris? It doesn't matter. But every time you stream it, I make money. Hmm? Oh, okay. I don't know. Oh. <laughs> yeah, but I must say you you bad in singing, you, bro. <laughs> hey, you 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 were playing uh, Ashanti. Uh, <laughs> I don't need to be good in singing. Well, I, I, <laughs> and, and I'm sure that you used to you used to rap and all that shit. No, up, but a rapper doesn't need to sing. I don't need to. Ah, for sure. Jesus. The way you are, ah, for no. sure. You can't even you can't but, even speak. But, but why would I need to? No, but you, you don't, don't, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't play games. I'm ask a question. <laughs> ask a question. And, 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 and say, don't play games. I'm, I, I don't fall for games. <laughs> so, uh, so you know, I don't need to sing, dog. Yeah. Yes. Why? You know, uh, why would I need to sing? Lota, tell me, what, what's your what's your day look like? Like, like when you wake up in the morning, what's your first thing that you think about? You wanna do what am I gonna do today? Yeah. That's it. Oh, you ask yourself that yeah. question. And then what, what are some of the answers that you get? Make money? No. That automatic already. It's oh. called passive income. So when you get to a passive oh. income stage, you don't need to. <laughs> <laughs> you are making money every day, don't worry. Get guaranteed, that's the one thing. Yeah. Yes, making money, that's, it's like breathing. Yeah. You understand? You don't need to think about it. You need to think to breathe. No, you can do it in your sleep, right? Yeah. You can make money in your sleep too. So... I don't know, man. I just think about, like, how do I get further with the plans that I've got? Mm. Like, how do I use today to get further with my plans from where I was yesterday? Do you wake up and say, you know what, today I want to shit on AK? No, man. You don't. Why would I do that? Pella, you'll be going why, why would I do that? Pella, you'll be going crazy on Twitter, eh? like talking about no, a specific person. Dog. I'm talking about a, I'm not. I'm talking about a song. If the song is, the, I don't like the song. It's, I don't like the song, dog. Yeah. The things that y'all niggas always trip because it's me that's saying that. Do you feel like people misunderstood you? No, I don't think it's like they misunderstood me. 
They do. No, I don't think that they. They don't need to understand me. It's not about misunderstanding or understanding. It's just, I. I don't think about people. Ah. I don't. I don't think. Oh, what am I gonna do? I see. If I see a song, I like hear a song. I say I like it. I don't like it. And then that's do, it. Do Do you feel like like you've spoken about a lot of things, a lot of subject, be it sensitive or not, that you got to a stage where you you. You have resisted all the negativity in this uh, media spaces in South Africa. Do you think I've made myself uncancelable? Is that what you think? Is that what you're asking? Yeah, that's, that's what I'm asking. No. I already made myself uncancelable before I said all the shit that I wanted. I made myself uncancelable first. Yeah. And then I spoke shit to prove it. Yeah. Yes. I made myself uncancelable and I spoke shit and then niggas oh, we'll see how far he goes talking this shit. Oh, we'll see how far he goes talking this shit. Oh, we'll see how far this is. <laughs> Would you say you speak shit or you speak the truth? You know, shit, I don't mean it as in, like, the real... The real when shit. When I say speak shit, yeah. is that I'm just saying stuff. You are. You're saying stuff. Game. Yeah. No, you, see, you know? Yeah, That's you say exactly. game. Yeah. I'm giving up game, yeah. You're giving up game. Mm. Ah, man. And, and then, you know what, Lothan? Um, I'd listen to you, man. I'd watch you and... You'd speak up on the things and I'm like, hey, so this thing exists. You know, mm. you speak up like you get some games. I don't mm. want to lie. And, and I want to ask you this now. Do you, do you feel like you, you're giving, like, or you investing or you putting up some games in a sense of, uh, I would wish to wake up one day based on the knowledge that you have and the genius that you have and wake up and like, okay, Nota what kids achieves or Batu or whatever bosses move. What? No, 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 no. no, no. Thing. Yeah. Why do you wish that I buy? Because you like you're so mm-hmm. smart, you're so intelligent. Like I, I feel no, like. Wait, 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 wait! I just need to tell you. Yeah. I own brands that are worth more than Batu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that what I built from the ground up. Wait, that I built from nothing. I'm just saying. So really? now, wait, wait. You want me to be Warren Buffett? Uh-huh. A guy who didn't build anything, just buys shares and stuff like that. I'm a good... But... Uh, uh, you no. Know. No, no, you know, you, know why, you know why I'm asking no time? Uh, listen to me. Get, no. get, get, understand no, me. What I'm trying to say is this. I don't need to buy a bad shoe. No, why? No, no. Let me tell you why. Because I can... Uh, dude, you see this brand that I'm wearing now? It's my little brother's brand. It's, it's it, my little brother's brand. What is, what is it? I don't know. It's not me. Come, come, no me, come, yeah, come, yeah. I don't know. I, I can't say this. I'm not a hot and tot. I'm not a no, 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 no. The correct word. No, what okay, no, ta, no, ta, no, ta, no, ta, no. Ta, maybe I'm not First putting. Ma, maybe I'm not putting my question right. It, no, but, but 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 think about it. No, this way. I'm saying forget your question. I'm saying that's a I dumb know, question. I'm not gonna forget my question. But yes, think of the. Oh, let me tell you something. If you ask better questions, you get better answers. Exactly. The, 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 yeah, quality, gonna... the quality of the answers you get is based on the quality, quality of the question. question. Yes. You understand? So what you are saying to me is that you are, you are saying, bro, you are now going to take value from wherever. Take money, value, from wherever, from whatever companies have built, and then use that value to buy into value that has been created by someone else. I'm a creator myself. Like Yeezy. Does not need to buy yes, Reebok. Yes, yeah, yeah. No, listen to what I'm um, saying. Um, listen to what I'm saying. Okay. Adidas yeah. sold Reebok, and I said, uh-huh. you know what? Yeezy should just buy Reebok. Now, mm-hmm. the reason why I wasn't saying you must buy the brand, buy the factories, the manufacturing plants in Boston mm-hmm. and everything else. You can buy that, mm-hmm. right? Because Reebok is selling, mm-hmm. so that you can manufacture your own shit for the Yeezy brand without Adidas. Adidas, but yes. Adidas wouldn't allow him to do that. He wouldn't be able because yeah. it's a company that they owned, and mm-hmm. he wouldn't be able to trade with a company that they owned or had more than five percent stake in. In a certain amount of time because of the contracts that he signed. So it was an impossible deal anyway. But that was the deal that he would... Had he not been in a deal with um, with Adidas at the time, when Adidas sold Rigobak, he could have bought it. Yeah. Just think about that. And then he would have had those factories to fucking manufacture. Right now, he can't buy those fucking factories because he's stuck in a fucking deal with Adidas. With Adidas, yeah. Who it's sold Reebok, which they could have saved had they, had they merged it with Yeezy. Yeah. You know, it's crazy how 
when I ask you a question, you deviate and you went to Adidas and the car. You're asking a dumb question, so I'm giving you a smart answer. <laughs> but I'm saying that you're not asking the question and, that you should be asking. And, and, and you, know, you know, the crazy part is that I can't ask you anymore. Why? Ah, uh, no, bra. Seriously. I want you to come home. No, no, come home. Listen no, to what ta. I'm saying. No, no, that's the thing that you were saying. So you're saying I must buy Batu. What I'm trying no, to no, say I'm is that saying... my little brother's got a no, brand. No. Hold on. My little brother's got a brand I, that he's, he's no, making. No, no, no. Wait, I'm... just wait, wait, wait. This is my little brother's brand, bro. Hey, c- touch my fucking I, collar, I, dog. I, wait. I fuck wait. With wait. No, I fuck with no, 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 no. Wait. No. It's not about fucking with it. Touch my collar, dog. Touch it like, no, touch it like you're touching it to test something. Yeah. You understand? This is something that your homies made. Yeah. I don't know, you life or you late or whatever. It's your homies. It's a merchandise. This is merchandise. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is a clothing brand. Dog. The, 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 the fucking dog. Who's ever seen a short sleeve turtleneck shirt like with a collar like this, dog? You see, my brother is not just a guy. Dog, look at the sleeve cuts. Wait. Hold on, this is a different style of sleeve yeah, cuts. It has dog. some design and a no, brand. No, dog. Oh, shit. But. It, it, I, where, yeah. where, 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 the thing is this is that you see now this is my problem this is exactly the problem Kanye had with Sway is that when are you make merchandise <laughs> you don't understand what I'm talking about <laughs> you understand that dog the machinery that makes this dog there's three countries that have it dog you understand what I'm saying there's three countries that have it dog you understand so now when I'm I need to go and make this I can't make a mistake why because I need to fly to that country <laughs> And make an order, get a sample. Get, get a sample go Spain and do that. I don't know. 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 I don't no, they can't do that. So you need to Adidas it out. Adidas, okay. Adidas gives you the money. Oh, yeah. you want to go to Spain? Okay, sure. Yeah. You want to go to whatever? You, you, you understand what so, I'm saying? So, so what's your, what's your take on, so, on, on, so on, rip, what, on rip with what, Fila? Now, what I'm trying to tell you is this. Okay. That's the thing. So what's my take with drip with Fila? Yeah. Ne? Don't say anything. I don't want you to scream. No, no, no. Don't say anything and uh, don't uh, chase anything. Yeah, no. Don't say anything. Short, clean. Don't say anything. Don't say anything. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Don't say anything. Wait, 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 wait. Don't say anything. Wait. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Don't say, eh, chief. You understand? So now, don't look at my moves and think. You see, Kanye is trying to bring the manufacturing back to South Africa. Mm. I'm telling Drip. Bring the manufacturing to South Africa. You understand what I'm saying? Come on, man. Look out. Get a dog. Stop alibaba it out. I'm not trying to kill his business. His brand is going to grow. I'm not going to say, yo. I never said, yo, burn down brick. I never said, burn your drip sneakers. I never said that. I said, drip must manufacture locally. That's what we must demand as the South African wow. people. We'll say, we'll support you. We'll support. Now, if then Lekau then says, okay, South Africans, if you guys want to pr- want me to bring the factory to South Africa, this is the price of the sneaker. Don't complain. Yeah. And then we'll say, fine. We want you to bring the jobs. Fine. We won't complain. And then we'll do the thing. And now we're moving. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Now yeah. we're moving. Yeah. Yeah. You understand? Now people are talking about, oh, Drip and Batu want to bring manufacturing to South Africa. Do you think I'm not part of those conversations and everything else? I'm not just part of the conversations, dog. I'm part of securing the land where the factories are going to be built. We've secured the factories. We've secured the factory. We've secured the land, bro. That's what we're working on, dog. We're not just tweeting. You understand what I'm saying? We've, we've secured the land, dog. We're going to bring jobs, dog. There's going to hey, be a prison hey. that's going to be emptied because the prisoners are not going to be prisoners anymore. They're going to be workers. And they're never going to go back to the fucking prison. Because they're going to have jobs. Now. Motherfucker. That's what I'm working on, dog. Fuck. I don't give a fuck what you guys are saying to me on Twitter, yeah, dog. dog. You understand yeah, what I'm saying? Dog. So... So please, man. Please, man. Please, man. You know? So, you know, I'm putting pressure on these guys to bring the jobs here because that's what we need. We need that. We can't be celebrating mediocrity. Exactly. 
Yeah, so we, can't, we, can't be, we can't be buying sneakers from Alibaba. Why? Because if Drip does it and it's successful, then Vaya is going to do it and it's going to be successful. Then the next guy is going to do it and then who's ever going to manufacture local? But would you say that the, 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 the collaboration of Drip and Fila, is it part of the strategic it's move? It's part of the strategic move because what is happening is that now Fila is showing the other international brands that if we want to make it in South Africa, South Africans love their local brands. And South Africans has... love their local Amapiano. Yes. South Africans buy drip sneakers. Yes. So if we want to sell Fila in South Africa, yeah. and we want to outsell Nike, and we want to outsell Adidas, let's do what yeah. they won't do, Fun. which is endorse drip. Endorse, yeah. And then what does Adidas do? Oh, we'll endorse the high end, like uh, uh, the uh, uh, Jeremy Scott of South Africa. They'll put a collaboration with Teba Makuku. But Teba Makuku is not a person who's designing clothes that capture the essence of South African yeah. culture. Like the aren't kids Kokasi who are like crazy about Chebama Kuku design, so we've got them on their fucking walls. Never. Yeah. But every kid got drip. Every kid right now. They inspire is, to they have drip. Dog. They want every colorway. Mm. They want this December, every colorway. In fact, if Legao can release 25 colors for December, kids will buy 25 colors. Yeah. It's just that now it's only seven colors. Sunday. You understand? <laughs> it's seven colors it's seven days a week but yeah, yeah Sunday <laughs> oh fuck did you know did you know, bro? Did you know bro? no I'm just saying that there's just a color for each day of the week oh okay. and I was saying you could have the color for each day of December yes yes because December we show up at December and you know every day is December you need to come with something fresh hey. December one. Yeah. Exactly. From the 16. Koya kwa. Koya ko. Kere ina. Kere ina ve. Yeah, and then new stuff every day. Kere ina ve. Kere new stuff. Kere new stuff. Kere new stuff one time. Kere new stuff. Yeah, yeah, man. And 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 one other thing that I just want to bring it home. Now, you speak about there, there was a time you were you posted a video mm. on Instagram. Mm-hmm. I think you were live or something like that, mm-hmm. and you speak about how. South African ladies, they don't even have two to three jobs that they are working on. Mm. They don't even deserve the money. They don't even. Talk to me through Look this. at them, dog. Look at them, dog. Our problem in this country is that we've got too many simps. We've got Nigerian simps, simps that are the worst. Yeah. They're the yeah. worst simps. They're the worst. Okay, okay. They're the worst. I'm, I'm, I'm serious. Like, if you're a Nigerian woman, right, and you've got a brother that's in South Africa, that's paying for girls to go to clubs, to buy liquor and everything else. And then when are your school fees? Go Ghana. Go Ghana is not being paid for. Fuck, yeah. That's but true. your brother's in, in Nigeria busy blessing South African girls with HIV. <laughs> and 10K. I'm just saying, Niger- our Nigerian sisters, please talk to your brothers. They are embarrassing you guys. They're embarrassing you guys. They're embarrassing you. They're going to come back to Nigeria and they're going to... Yeah. Infect all of you. You're gonna, you're gonna, even you're gonna be suffer. You're, you're gonna, gonna suffer. suffer. You're, you're gonna, gonna suffer. suffer. So it's fine. Yeah. It's fine. Pop the bottles. Do you? Pop the bottles, guys. Pop the but, bottles. But what, what, what not you say is taking care of the lady. I mean, like if a Nigerian guy with a South African sister, how much is he sending to his mother? He's sending this to a woman who can't even dog. You know, you know that on, on talking about sending how much, how much you send on your. You're spending mother. hundreds of thousands of rand on ladies, bitches. Ladies you haven't that, spent even a tenth on that on your mother. Ladies, they don't love uh, Limpopian guys. Why? Pedi guys. Because they no, said Limpopo guys. Uh, Limpopo uh, guys. Pedi pe- pe- guys. All Limpopo guys. No, no, no. Pe- I, guys. All. Okay, sure. All. Oh, oh, all. Just like you guys in Limpopo, you have the majority, but yeah, yeah. you're not that much. They don't the love them because they send money to their yes, mothers. mothers. Yes, Linda. Even my, my wife would complain that, yo, why yeah. does your mother do this? I say, this is my mother, chief. Yeah. Yeah. Without her, there's no me. Mm. Without me, th- you have nothing. We have nothing. You understand? Fuck. You have nothing. So these the, 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 the Nigerian brothers that the ones that are killing the whole thing off. They're the worst. I'm that, not saying they're the ones that yeah. are killing. They're the do worst. Do you feel like do you feel like South African ladies? Zimbabwean are late? brothers as well. There's, there's some Zimbabwean brothers who are also now getting into this habit. Mm. Uh. Congo, yeah. Congolese. Ah, uh, the Congolese brothers now. They're more disciplined. Really? Yeah, they're more disciplined. Congolese brothers, a lot of them, like they, you find them in, in working spaces. They either work in the security fields and stuff like that. You don't see them as like 419 scammers or Yahoo yeah. boys and stuff like that. They're not doing that shit. Fuck. Do you feel like South African ladies are lazy? Yes, they are. 
now the modern South African women are lazy. Mm. Our mothers used to wake up, dog. Our mothers would fill the taxi rank at four. Wait. You understand? Good with maguinha, a bucket full of maguinha. And then what happened with them? What happened with that money from maguinha? You would buy your toughies. Yeah. You understand? To school, you understand? Yeah. And so, so now what are the South African ladies of today doing? You don't see them fr- with wholesome frying maguinha. No, no, for saying. Never. No, you see them with nails. They can't do fuck all. They can't do fuck all. Uh-huh. And think about it, dog. You know what I think about when I think all these ladies with nails, ne? Mm. It's because like me and I back in my bachelor days, it was before the nails had gotten this long. Yeah. But if I remember nails that have that long, you can't use a condom with nails that long. So what are you saying? I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. The only niggas you can't. No, but, it, but it's it, not the ladies that put on the condom. It's the guy. As a man, if you put your dick, insert it inside a woman, yeah. you're asking for a rape case. You're asking for it. You're asking for it. Oh. You're asking for it. So it if raw. ever you penetrate, no, it's not about going raw. If ever you penetrate, she must be the one that's holding it and penetrating herself. Ah. But that, that would be on the second that is, that is tacit consent. Ah, but that tacit consent. That would be on the second round when you hit no, it No, it's not a second round. When you hit it No, it's, it, no, <laughs> no, it's not second round. It's not second round. Yeah. Make her want it. Or, 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 yeah. you have to, if you want it, you have to put it in yourself. She'll put it in. She wants it. So if it has a condom, it's fucked up. No. No, if she puts it in herself and she's got those nails. Nails, it can't be. It's going to burst the condom. Mm. Ah. <laughs> they, made it, they made them stronger now. They made them stronger. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> they made him strong enough. Are they strong enough? Are they uh, the Megs? Okay, it's have, no longer choice. Have you ever? Megs. Okay, I, I don't know. I don't know. I I, I stopped. Uh, the, uh, Government. Yeah, long Government. time ago, before they made Megs. But uh, <laughs> I, but I'm just saying. You no, had no I'm just choice. Saying, you had no choice. It, no, I had <laughs> options. I had options. Uh, yeah, I had options. What choice? Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> better options. So, um, <laughs> what I'm trying to say is this. Now these girls of the, I don't know, because you are the ones who are busy with these slay queens of today. You guys are the single I'm right? in the same age as you, but I'm I know. Married. You guys are single. I'm talking, I'm married. So I'm saying that you are the uh, ones. But I'm a, I also have a girlfriend, but let me make it clear. I have a girlfriend that I'm committed to. Okay, fine. But I'm just saying, from your friends who are not married and whatever. All my friends are married. So, they, they don't know these slay queens with these long nails. Fuck, I've never Does your girlfriend have long nails? No, she doesn't. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. So I'm saying these slay queens with these long nails. Yeah. Those niggas is going in strapless. But 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 that's what that's what you'd get. Hey bro, you know what? I must tell you. Now. Okay, hold on. Let me hold on. Wait, 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 wait. I just gave this bitch fifty thousand right? Right? Fifty K, yeah. right? Yeah. And then I have to put on a condom so I can't feel the shit. I'm just asking. protect yourself. I'm I'm just asking. Why don't I just find myself a clean girl who cannot be bought? Who's a virgin <laughs> or whatever? Ah, it's, a, it's a fantasy love, man. It's a fantasy love. Like a condom. Yay. So that you can't feel it. You know, I, I think there's there's fantasy in going to a club. Of us. Dog. Of us are all okay. like Let, let's, talk about, let's talk about let's talk about why don't uh, uh, they wear porn and uh, why don't they wear condoms in porn? Some do, some do. Ah, but it's an arrangement that one they, they belong to a certain organization. The, the only ones are, are the Family local ones. ones, are the local ones because they don't test, they don't do testing. Like American porn, they don't use because con- it takes away from you know, it takes away from the why would you be using a strap? <laughs> nah, but they do this one, they, this one they are employed, bra- the porn star they are employed by brazers or whatever. Exactly. Yeah. So the local ones, they don't have a company that can employ them that can make sure they go through a proper testing regimen and everything else. And therefore, when you watch their content, it's not as nice as the but content. If I get it, but if I get what it, what I'm trying to say is that the, the, the most enjoyed content is the one that's strapless. Is the unsafe sex has got more views than safe sex. But if that's I... Got, no, wait, wait. Don't uh, say but. Okay. We just spoke <laughs> about a fact. Yeah. I'm just saying a numeric fact. You understand what I'm saying? Uh-huh. That's it. So if red cars are outselling yellow cars, let's discuss... Is. The fact that the reason why is because there's something about the red car that makes it more attractive to people. True. People are attracted to the condomless sex. Now, if people are attracted to condomless sex, we're using porn to study people's sexual behavior because it's the best way to... You, 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 you've got a big sample size. Yeah. Yeah. You can understand yeah. what people's sexual t- tastes and everything else based on the content that they gravitate towards to in the porn sites. Yeah. You understand? So your porn algorithm is like your TikTok alg- algorithm. If porn was being You're not on TikTok, to, no? because I don't want um, the Chinese government to have an algorithm of things that trigger me 
Yeah. Because that's basically what you're doing on TikTok. You're telling these motherfuckers, this is how to get me. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> this is how guaranteed. Yeah. Because that's what happens. Because you, you open TikTok and all of a sudden, guaranteed, you just... <laughs> every time. <laughs> every time. Fuck, is that <laughs> 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 Okay, man. This is me, yeah. This is me. So you're lying that. I'm, I'm so whether you like it, I'm, uh, I don't know. It's like, it's like a drug, dog. No, the no, 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 like, so now you're in that drug. It, it, uh, it Chinese, knows you. It no, knows the chat you, dog. No more no notification. How about notification? You stop everything, dog. Yeah. Open your notification and you know, you know when you open that thing, you're gonna enjoy it. <laughs> you know. You know they trained you. Because every time you open that notification, you enjoy it. No, no, no. There by TikTok, I normally do you know she shit, bruh? Watch TikTok, dog. What are you no, doing? No, 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 but Shibi Shibi is not on TikTok. What is it? Okay, Shibi Shibi is the rare pilot. No. <laughs> it's a no. <laughs> Can you tell me about your cousin? No, it's not. Let's leave him. It's not Jesus. It's not how we want to bring him to the public eye. <laughs> <laughs> so you can't give TikTok your algorithm. Yeah, you can. You can't give them that control. So what I'm trying Wait. to say is that now we've got the porn algorithm. We understand what content works on porn. Fuck. You understand? Man. So now these guys that are spending money on girls. Yeah. Now, let me tell you something. Prostitutes will tell you this. Niggas that pay for sex don't want to use condoms. Really? They don't. Prostitutes will tell you this. Niggas say, I paid for this. I don't want to use a condom. I paid for this. I want to have. I, how much to for us to not use a condom? Shh. Niggas have Truvada. I'm yeah. serious. They've got Truvada, dog. You understand yeah. what I'm saying? They're taking Truvada. They're going strapless. It is what it is. Crazy. You understand? Okay, let's say, okay, who's the the, 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 the most desired it girl slay queen right now in the game? Not the ones that are taken, the ones that are single or whatever. Name them. Uh, who? Uh, Queen Minaj. Uh, Who's that? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's say Doromungi. Doromungi, yeah. Okay, Doromungi says, okay, uh, you can Don't. smash today yeah. for 25 the, 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 Wait, the wait, wait, wait. Uh, no, no, no. Let's leave it. Doromungi. Doromungi, we're using Doromungi as an example. Let's not go far. Doromungi says, you'll smash today for 25 thou. Mm-hmm. She wants a bag. Yeah. She tells you the bag, right? There's a price list or whatever. She's going to Gucci right now. Yeah. She's saying by the time she gets there, it needs to be paid for and she can collect it. And then she's coming to your place and she's giving it to you. Hey, how about, how about when she gets to your place, but that one you when, you, when she gets to your place, are you going to put on a condom? After spending 25000 to buy that bag from Gucci. If you have money, maybe you would. Uh, but I mean, like, if I have money, it's if I... Like, dog, listen, yeah. it's a hypothetical situation, dog. You don't have Doromungi's numbers. You've never spoken to her. <laughs> she doesn't follow you. You understand? You've got nothing to lose here, dog. You understand? No, no, but I mean, I'm just saying, be honest. No, no, I'm just... For I'm, I'm talking about Doromungi because that's one you, you, you can't even get I to. I know, I know, I know, I know her. I know her. Okay. Oh, if she want to give it to me now. I'm saying, if you, I'm you bought... you. Twenty-five thousand already. You no, no, no. Twenty-five thousand. She's on the way, and you know that this. No, ta, but this, 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 no, ta. this meeting cost me twenty-five thousand. I, I paid twenty-five thousand for this meeting. No, no, ta, no, ta. Kamrote, <laughs> ah. <laughs> no, ta. That boy is underage. No, that boy is underage. I'm not talking about. Ah, ah. I'm saying I'm talking about pissing. I'm peeing in her mouth <laughs> like urine. <laughs> you go with some Marikili like, shit. Marikili shit. <laughs> Got 25, yeah. Ka. No, no, no. Ka, but uh, for, for me, for 25, come right there. No, I don't no, know. Other niggas, they want to do other shit. You know why I say if you have money? Think about it this way. If, if you have money, dog. No, no, no. If, like, you can afford ARV, dog. <laughs> I, no, 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 no. But what I'm saying is that think about it this way, guys. Maybe you guys will relate. Lota does not relate. Magic yes. Johnson has money, dog. Yes. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> no, dog, Lota has a lot of money. Lota has a lot of money. No, dog. No, 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 no. Bra, like, I have I have hundred rats now. 
and I will. Okay, let me let me. I will, will never. I will never. Let me take it away from porn and everything else. No, why? it's not porn. Okay, okay what about why don't wrong. married people use condoms though? They're married, those ones. Exactly. They're it's married. so enjoyable. So now you're gonna pay for Dora and then you're gonna make sure you put it on a condom so you don't enjoy it. Yeah, but if I have money to spend, like if I have so twenty-five thousand to spend, money to not enjoy. That's what I'm saying. You're stupid. No, but it's that's not. That's why it. God will never give you money. <laughs> God will never give a fool money. A guy who does not enjoy it. But <laughs> <laughs> are you so so so, 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 so are you, but are you saying no god it's too good for me here against any condom but are you saying or unprotected self un, are you saying or protected not self protected no protected self is not enjoyable it's not as enjoyable no it's not it's, it's not, not as, how do you, you you've got a, a plastic dog you got, yeah. you're not even feeling a dog what the fuck are you talking about dog what the fuck are you talking about dog ah no time but are you feeling the plastic dog you're feeling the plastic, dog. Mm. What are you talking about? <laughs> no, 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 no. You're feeling the plastic. Ah, dog. no, but no, ta. no, no. Okay, so I say majority of the guys that would buy those ladies, the slave queens, they don't use condom. No, why would they? Dog, I, after spending that much money, why would you use a condom, dog, to not enjoy it? That's what I'm trying to say. Why would you spend a condom to not enjoy it? Why would you spend that much money to have sex to not enjoy it? Shots, man. There's a lot of there's a lot of uh, disease that is floating around. So yeah? that's why if you are busy with those girls, yeah, that's what you are you're signing yourself up for, dog. A permanent subscription, like you said. Yeah, that's that. <laughs> 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 a permanent <laughs> subscription. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. Crazy. Come on. And, and, and the, the crazy part about it is that you get a lady you fuck with, you like her, mm. and you're like, okay, She's this is my that life. No, and besides, she's still in that life. Mm. She's still in that life. Yeah. Or she's going to that life. Mm. And then you're out here saying, this is me here. Mm. Fuck. Yeah, but no. we mustn't put that narrative here. No, That's... we must. We yeah. must laugh at them. <laughs> 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 I laugh at them. No. Really? I laugh at... Oh, I laugh at them, dog. I fuck. Me. I laugh at them, dog. Let me tell you something. But what kind of person? Something. What if you're dating a rapper or a DJ? Uh-huh. You must know. That this is a DJ. He bro. fucked off the lineup. No, like, uh-huh. like this guy's not a famous DJ. Uh, he is. No, he's not a famous DJ. Ah, uh, you he's don't. Not on the top of the headline. He's but you, the you don't. Ah, uh, the problem is that you don't know no, him. It's not, but it's not. It's part of the many more. Uh, <laughs> you That's for the to your It's fine. It's part of the many more. <laughs> sure. You understand what I'm saying? Do you understand what I'm saying? Nah, no, so that's what I'm saying is this: if you're if you're dating, I think you must know that this nigga has fucked half the lineup. Really? Why not? Okay, who, who, okay, we are going, ne, on the festival, whatever, ne, mm-hmm. everybody else has bought tickets to the festival, yeah. all of us are here, the, the, our only options are us, who are booked here, yeah. I mean, eventually, we're gonna have fucked, all of us are gonna have fucked each other, true, eventually, true, it's, the, it's like, it, it, you put people in high school for how many years, for two decades, for, uh, it's like, I mean, five, five years, oh, yeah, 20 years I've been in the game, I'm just saying. I'm, yeah. I'm still in the same high school. Oh, okay. Yeah, and then it's still the same industry. Yeah. Because it's no, it's not like okay, now we're going to university. Now there's another, you know, unless you leave uh, the country and you go to other markets. But I'm sure there are uh, there are some loyal DJs out there. It's not about loyal DJs, dog. Yeah. It's about you, you run through the girls. You'll run through the girls. The only difference with like club girls is that there's a new stock every single year. It's first years. I was telling my girlfriend that I wanna be a a, a soul in R&B DJ, and she refused. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> She, she doesn't want you to get that money. She needs to accept that you need to get pussy to get that money. You know why? Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Yeah. If you don't get pussy, you don't feel confident. If you don't feel confident, but you, you get don't a play pussy a you get a pussy from Let me tell you something. I need to know when I'm playing a song that these bitches want to fuck me. Otherwise, I'm not confident. I might play the wrong song. Nah, but you can't go to every place and want to get a pussy. Yeah. I need to go to every place knowing that all these bitches want to fuck me. I don't care if you came with your husband, you want to fuck me. I, if I'm the biggest dick in the world, oh, you wanna fuck? Yes. Me, so that you would fuck. Okay. Not that you will. Yeah, that's yeah, what I'm trying yeah, to say. Yeah, 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 yes. yeah, 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 yeah. And the yeah. thing is that to only the only way to have confidence that that is true is to test yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. So you understand? So you, you don't need to test it. Yeah. So now the thing is that you can't have the uncomfortable conversation with your woman to say, listen, if I come to this level, I'm I'm gonna be making this money, but if I get famous, I'm gonna need to be testing. And let me tell you something. The problem with you niggas, ne, is that y'all fuck bitches that your woman will not be proud of. Uh, That's your problem. Ah. <laughs> Mina, if I get caught I fucking a bitch, if I if I get caught <laughs> fucking a bitch, my woman is going to have a, a meeting with that bitch. Don't shake hands. It, no, it'll be a woman to woman. Kissy you. Oh, 
Ah, you're taking it to the next level. I know you are. You're, no, in, I, <laughs> you're in 2026 now, uh, but uh, don't take What do you mean? No, I know you are. I'm not talking 26. Fast. I'm not talking 26, dog. Yeah. I, I'm, not talking, I'm not naming names. Yeah. But I'm just saying, you need to fuck a bitch that your, your woman's going to be like, yo, I. You know what? I like, can't be mad at him. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> because the, the mere fact that this bitch wants my nigga shows me that I got the nigga. You know, today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is the nigga to have. Yeah. You understand? So, what I'm trying to say is that niggas, please, guys, if you're going to fuck bitches, make sure that your woman is proud. Fuck, okay. And that's it. That's the only thing. Wait, that's the rules. That's what, I, that's what I tweeted this morning. Yeah. That's it, young boys. That's the tip to your young boys. Because Wait. you guys are getting caught with. Nonsenses, and then your woman disrespects you. The yeah. problem is that she, you must fuck a bitch that will make your woman respect shake. you more. They must, she must shake. She must respect you more. Mm. She must shake. Yeah, she must respect you more. She'll be like, yo. <laughs> it, it, it's, 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 today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Today, <laughs> today, or, <laughs> <laughs> today, today or yesterday, it was, it, it has been a year. Dog, let me tell you something. Let me tell you a story. Let me okay. tell you something. Yeah, I when know. I was still, when okay, I was still, wait, 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 wait. Wait, don't tell this is my show. Wait, wait, <laughs> wait, wait. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you a story. <laughs> don't tell this is my so show. I was at Devon July, ne? Yeah. So, so at Devon July, ne? Um, we're we're traveling with the with the team, with my yeah. team. So obviously, with the team, we're on the road. So a lot of niggas don't know. Oh, I used to DJ for Questa. Why to save money? To save money on the show, so we could have a, a nicer band, so we can train the band, so yeah. we can have a solid band. He mm-hmm. still works with that same band, same team, and everything else. I built that whole entire team. That's yeah. the best live show on the road. Uh-huh. You understand? That's the best live show. The Questa show is the best live show on the road. I made sure that that is solid. Why? So that he can keep on earning off of mm-hmm. that team. You know? It's a still business. using it now. It's a system. Yes, it's a yeah. system. Okay. You know, I could extricate myself from it. I tested it many times. I went to New York, did trips, did niggas did gigs. I replaced myself. I was like, clean. That's how you are able to build a business. You don't have a business unless you can take yourself out of the business. And let it run. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, no, so th- that's why I had the business. So I had that system. So now we had a gig in Durban. It's Durban July weekend and everything else. Like when was it? 2018. 2018. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah. So we had a gig in Durban. And then now we're in the bus. So we drove our buses down there. So we're waiting for the gig outside the club. I said, boys, just wait for a second, two seconds. Yeah. I'm calling an Uber. In. Then the Uber pulls behind the bus. Clean. The niggas are waiting for me to get out of the bus. To get in the Uber. I said, no, I'm not getting the uh, bus. The Uber's for my bitches. Oh. Yeah. So then they saw the bitches, four of them, in the Uber. Then the Uber followed us in the bus to the hotel. Now, relax. Okay. Hey, don't worry, these are my bitches, but <laughs> <laughs> Relax, don't worry about my bitches. No, 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 no. My bitches no, no, no. Yeah, they're not going to do nothing. So, yeah, dog. Come on. I, 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 come on. So, so, <laughs> bitches go to church too. Uh, no, my, you know? my, 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 my father's a pastor. Mm-hmm. And he gets his dicks up too. <laughs> so, <laughs> my bitches were in the Uber following the piano. Yeah. Yes. I'm not gonna let the bitches come into the piano with my team, my, wow. my employees. And you have space in your piano. Mm. <laughs> that's, that's a good place. That's no, there's no space. There's niggas in the piano. Oh, no, okay. Yeah, there's yeah, no yeah. space. Yeah, yeah. But niggas thought I was getting the piano so I could hop in the. No! I'm not taking one girl from the club. No. I'm feeling an Uber from the club. Yeah. Me, like one man. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Then I go to a hotel, whatever, whatever. Yeah. I chill. My team members are there. My, the drummer is there. The, road, the guy who's DJ now. The guy who replaced me is there. Yeah. I pass out. When I wake up in the morning, clean. Damn it. No wallet, no phone or whatever. Clean. I get up to the hotel phone. I call the guy thing and I say, no, I'm awake now. Yeah, oh, you're awake. Okay, no, we'll bring your phone and your wallet and everything. That's why. Because I'm in the room with fucking five bitches, dog. And these niggas don't know these bitches. You do not fuck them. It doesn't matter whether I fuck them or not. <laughs> That's not the point. The point is that my team knows that, okay, fine. When we leave the boss, we need to make sure that all his valuables are safe. Uh, yeah. Yes. When you leave the boss, then the boss passes out now. You understand? These bitches are tired out the boss and the boss passes out. You know, he can't wake up and say, hey, they're taking my phone, they're taking my wallet. What happened? Yeah. And I said, and I said, he can't. He can't. And I said, so why don't they make sure they take everything? They tell the bitches, bitches, you guys stay here until boss wakes up. You understand? Okay. Sure. When I woke up, 
clean sharp bitches every everywhere it's sharp it's fine yeah. no problem no problem then we call it the phone clean where's my stuff clean my stuff comes clean clean okay no bitches fine i want you to see everything else clean clean breakfast one of your bitches ah go down to the uh, thing with jake clean hey hey hey, hey. hey. that's it so <laughs> you talk about this guy's telling me about time bro. i feel like we can talk more we can talk forever we haven't we haven't spoken about it Nah. A lot of things, man. Like what? Nah, I still have to ask you a lot of things. Like, there's a lot of things that I've learned from Greedy that I still have to ask. My man, can't we get a number card? Yeah. 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 We need to get to that level. What's up, we've been to a fair. We've been to a fair. We've just been to a fair because we're on top. Yeah. No, it's not about that. <laughs> and then, ah, it's, no, it's not about that, guys. It's about the art. That's the thing. Like, we take things the wrong way. We need really? to be honest. If we're honest, yes. podcasting is not at that level. None of y'all niggas, none of y'all niggas can compete with Meg G. Mm. None of y'all. No, we so can't. you guys are not even doing the same thing. No, we can't. No, that guy, he, he had a, like, so much spread. Like, his spread is so... It's not that spread. That you guys are, are. Uh, South Africans, we love this thing of pretending we know what we're talking about. Yeah, we... So, our Jebo he will tell you exactly how things work. Our Jebo he's never opened a fucking book in his life. Mm. He sits in the corner and he's get out child and food. I know this thing. Or I know this thing. How do you know? The reason why MG is where he is is because I planned him with YouTube. I just told you, motherfuckers. Yeah. I told you that YouTube did a whole entire fucking event. Really? That's it. Which means that YouTube meant to make sure that on every video that you watch on YouTube, the next video is MG. Yeah. Yes, that's it. That's the reason why. When you're not there, when, I, when you watch your video, somebody has to search your name and Google your video. When, uh, when they watch your video, the next video that comes is my G. <laughs> exactly. After they Google they say you are, you send them to my G. So if you understand what I'm saying, that's why my G is ahead of all of your niggas. Because all your niggas, what you're doing is sending people to him. Because YouTube says, oh, anything that's a podcast, we put my G next. Yeah. yeah. That's it. Because once they watch my G, they stay on the channel for longer. And that's not just move. That's it. Simple. That one simple move. It's a one simple move. One simple move. I, that's the guy I chose. I said to you, I'm putting you here. Did you, did you, see, what, did you see potential in your Yes, right? I did. That's what I said. I yeah. saw potential. But I've been with you for some time. Yes. Oh, like, but either way, I saw potential in him doing this because I knew that you no know, radio station going to hire him. Mm. And I also knew that he'd be committed to podcasting. He's not going to now use podcasting to now get a radio job. Okay. I didn't give my G that power so he can go and get a radio job. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So when I gave Meg G that power, I didn't want him to now use that power to get Saul Peluka a radio job so that he can then use his radio money to shit on Meg G because Meg G can't afford to pay him what radio is paying him because this is only YouTube. But don't you think that like, Paul uh, who Saul is doing very well in terms of... Doesn't matter. He's doing doing what what I mean, it doesn't matter. I'm, I'm, I'm controlling him. He's under my control. So mm-hmm. that's what I tell him to do. You need to understand that. I control Saul. Oh. Uh, seriously, I press his buttons. I tell you, if I go to Starbucks and I say, so, never mention my wife again. And then he never mentions my wife after that. Do you have, I'm, I, I, wait, does not that not show you that I'm under control? Yes, you are. Right. right? I can treat whatever I want about so. What is right now? Mean? He is not about everything. He has everything to lose. He has his job to lose, his career to lose. Because as soon as the, the, the podcast and chill fan base turns on him, every opportunity that he's got because of that fan base, he loses. Do you think there would be a point where uh, the friends of Podcast and Chill turn against Saul? If he sells out, yes. If he sells out immediately. They're protecting him during the time. It's not they're protecting him. It's not when you were saying like... They never protected out. him. I protected him. No, I no. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Uh-huh. I showed him. I showed him exactly what would happen with that fan base if he were to sell out. You understand what I'm saying? Uh-huh. You understand what I'm saying? That fan base showed him, he saw in real time that if I were to ever think of leaving this podcast in you, yeah, <laughs> these niggas would turn me immediately. These niggas are not here to support me, they're here to support the podcast. Mm-hmm. I taught him that. That was the only way to teach him that. Because he's got an outlandish ego. You think that I wasn't on the phone with Saul's manager that whole entire time, pressing the buttons. I'm helping Saul's manager manage Saul, because Saul's manager is unable to manage Saul. Saul is telling his manager, hey, you, man, I'm your manager, you work for me, whatever. Mm. You understand? Then when he gets to the gig, he wants to drink as much as he wants, he wants to get drunk, he wants to... And I'm telling the manager, dog, this guy is fucking up your bread. You are using 
this job so that you can take your kid to school and everything else. He's the talent, right? Mm-hmm. But he can fuck it up. He can fuck it up as the talent and all of you guys lose. And your family loses and everything you've invested in building his brand and protecting his brand is lost. It's you need yeah. to be able to have this guy under control. Because if he's reckless, then you lose. Your job yeah, is yeah, to manage. manage. Yeah. And then the ego, manage it. Manage the ego. Because the ego gets to a certain point. There was a point in time where he was giving MacG hell. Now he doesn't even care about his, his, his podcast and chill contract. He doesn't even care because he does it for fun. And he knows that this is the platform that makes him popular so that he can earn on all the other platforms. But officially he has outgrown that. It's not about outgrowing it, he'll never outgrow that. And that's the thing, that's the attitude of people like you. You think like that because you think of your own problems that don't even have the money that he has right now. And then you think that with the lack of success, mm-hmm. you know better. To even think that you can think that I can assume from watching this guy and observing with my lack of success and lack of experience in mm-hmm. success that this guy could do better. Mm-hmm. Isn't that arrogance? Mm-hmm. Wait, I understand that. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And then that's what uh, divides brothers. Because a whole bunch of you gets into Saul's ear telling him you've outgrown the podcast. You're too big for the podcast. Yeah. And it's not doing enough for you now. You should be getting out of food. No, no, that, that's not the truth. You are, you are completely wrong. And if he listens to you who is completely wrong, right? You're not going to be there when he falls off. Mm. When he can't pay his bills. You know what I mean? If Saul listens to you, yeah. who's tweeting him on Twitter, and says, and, say no. You know, and, and talks shit about no to Alpha, yeah. no to whatever, and Saul forgets that the opportunities that he's had, that I have held his hand and taken him to, I didn't need to. You understand? The doors that are open for him personally, I didn't need to. And he then takes me being upset and a decision he's made, me being upset, and erases everything that I've done to benefit him personally and listens to someone who's done nothing for him ever. Ever. Never even spent my it never seen his spent. Now I booked Saul to host. I paid him. I put money in his account directly. You understand what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I've supported him as a business person. I mean, not personally. I'm not like the guy on Twitter who then he listens to that guy. That's a stupid person. Mm-hmm. So you understand what I'm saying? So that's why you can tell that both Saul a guy that you need to control. You can't uh, go with what Saul is saying. You need to control him, you need to decide for him, and then put him into a situation where he can't get himself out of it. And then he's stuck there. And that's fine. That's the only way to control a person like that. Mm-hmm. Because otherwise he will destroy everything. He's, every opportunity that he's had by himself where he hasn't been managed or controlled is destroyed. Wow. Think about it. Why then? Destroyed. Why then? Destroyed. And people say, no, why do you mention the things that he's done in his life? Because those are patterns. Mm. And patterns repeat. What does the mention nice? It, it destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> I destroyed. I because people wanted to mention that and then this guy is so unreliable. He's, hey, we are yeah, yeah, yeah. And he said, no, let me do this. Let me do this. Yeah. He asked for it. Destroyed it. But it's fine. Okay, so okay. Uh, what about the other one? So, uh, what's yeah. the other one? Which one is this one? Mm. Destroy it. Which one is the other one? Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. the cartoon thingy. Yeah, yeah no, no, it's not like that. Destroy it. <laughs> it's not me. Did I destroy anything of the Did I destroy his Did I destroy his Did I destroy his yeah. to do a campaign, to do a 
a post and he used that same money and used it to place a bet. He wasn't losing money. That he was he was using monopoly money. And I thought I was like, and then when you're the fool, you watch his tweet and then you now get into gambling debt and you end up being like Saul Penduga and you need to owe Boiti money. Imagine owing Boiti money. Imagine Boiti wherever she is. You understand? Knowing that some guy who blessed her, that blessing got passed on to Saul Penduga. So some blesser out there knows that yeah, that money that Boiti gave to Saul, she got it from me. Do you, do you think do you think do you think uh, Prince Nduga uh, Saul Nduga Saul? Yeah, Prince Nduga, Prince Nduga, Prince Nduga, yeah, Prince Nduga, yeah, fuck. Saul Nduga put on the uh, the podcast and shit. No, I think in the sense of no, he did not grow. No, I, I, he did not. Because I, I feel like no, no, no. I think when he put up, when no, he put up, see, that's the thing. I, you, 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 you wanted to frame my answer. You know, I'll shout, I'll shout, I'll shout. Don't worry. Okay. What I'm trying to tell you is this, right now. The reason why, the, the first episode, the second episode the song was there as a kid. He yeah. said, yeah, no, I was speaking to Nota. He said that yeah. about having you in the podcast, I said, yeah, it's going to be done in German. Yeah. Now, if you heard that, then you should understand my relationship with Meg G. Do you hear what Meg G said? Mm-hmm. Meg G said that I spoke to Nota and he, I asked for advice and he said, you guys are going to be dumb and dumb. And, dumb. Yeah. and, and that was the first opportunity that they had yeah. to prove whether they're dumb and dumb or not. What happened? So you got said some transparent joke and then they lost all the bags. Dumb and dumb. Why? Because I said, one of you needs to be the dumb nigga, the other needs to be the smart nigga. If both of you are dumb and dumb, you have destroyed the podcast. Oh, fuck. You know what I'm saying? So basically what I was putting them under pressure, I was putting them under pressure so that Saul knows his role is to be normal, mm. to study, to read, to get perspective. And that's why I was feeding him with information, feeding him with things to book. You understand? Know to get him into the head. But I wasn't doing that so I had to do it for him forever. I wanted him to get into the head. So if I want to be a, a good podcaster, my job is to, when I'm sitting at home, because all I do is work for three hours a week. How many enjoy this life? Three hours! Too much so. Oh, so. Yeah. How many hours do you I mean, it's, it's the Uber. It's the Uber to David Rakhagara Studios. Sit down. It's one and a half hours. And then the Uber back home. Three hours. Okay. Be, be, be. No, 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 wait. Okay. I don't need to work. I've got a passive income. So, yes. no, no. I don't need to work. I'm not talking about work. I'm just talking about. I don't need to work. I'm talking about Delhi Mashabe. What? You once, you once posted and said like you got a degree by listening to. I got his MBA. MBA by listening to his podcast. Yeah, because it is. Dope ass. Yes, because it's it dope ass. He, he interviews people who actually understand work in the industry. I found out the work. Is that you learn about the industry? Yeah. You learn about the behind the scenes and you're like, oh, okay, oh, okay, oh, yeah. oh, next time, see you. Yeah, come on. <laughs> That's the English I've for you. So that yeah. doesn't have yeah. the millions of views, Yeah. but the amount of money is nice. No, wait, just think about the audience. Wait. Just think about this audience. Mm. The amount of money that those people make. Mm. What, the, what money do they make? They make serious money. So mm. now if I want to advertise Porsche, Porsche. Yeah. Do you think I'm going to go to McG and advertise Porsche for McG? No. I'll go to Dave. Brad David. Brad D. Get a Brad D. And then Brad D. Ah, la te, some white nose tra, legend about this, Dr. Valeza. Dr. Valeza, ah, hey, Brad D, thank you for the test drive. Hey, that Porsche was nice. Hey, what, 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 what? And then someone's gonna watch. <laughs> Call them and buy. Same time. Call them and buy. Same time. <laughs>
to do what Lexi is doing. Fuck. Are you still paying the membership there? Yes. Why would, I, why would I stop? I'm the one who's influencing. I'm the biggest influencer for people to listen to podcasts. I'm the biggest influencer for people to support podcasts. I'm the biggest influencer for people to join as members of podcasts, to donate to podcasts. I'm influencing that behavior. I'm making it cool. I'm like the nigga who comes into the nightclub and sits at the corner and buys all the nice bottles and then makes sure all the hot bitches are at my fucking table. And now all you motherfuckers want some of these bitches. We're like, no, we're gonna be like, no, Tale. What have you got like no time? No time don't gonna be spending money and blowing money. Hey, let me now. Let me blow money. Let me blow money. And then all of a sudden, no time sends 70 rand. And then Kim, someone says, okay, 200. Okay, no time 1,000. And 2,000. You're like, hey, 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 we're growing now. What? We're Yeah, I get it. Yeah, it's my little car. I was buying for. I bought. I bought for Yams. I bought for Winter Smith. I bought for for Uncle Vinny. I bought them the VSOP. Really? Yeah. What are we spending tonight? Uh, what are we spending? Yeah, you're going to. I have much time. The bitches wanna go to the famous nigga, right? Hey. And that's why the, the, the niggas with money but are always with There's always a, one famous nigga amongst the niggas with, uh, with money, right? Because the niggas with money, they're the ones that make the bitches feel comfortable. Uh, but the niggas with fame, they're the ones that attract the bitches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they're about the social capital. They, they, come on, if the biggest baller in the club, right? The yeah. biggest baller in the club, he just spent 20,000 bottles, right? But he shuts down Instagram and he posts hey, the story. He's like, yeah, I'm here with no time. I was there, but- Wait! Okay, you know what I said. Okay, so please. This is uh, what I said. Did you repeat what I just said? Uh, no. I said the biggest baller in the club, right? When you post and say, now nah, we'll move the water. He'll pop 20 bottles. Yeah, and, and post about it. And shout. Yeah. That's the nice. And then the, the next story, yeah. he'll post, I'm with no time. That one is the one that will get more engagement. But like I, like I said, no. You understand what I said? He'll get more comments. If bitches will come, oh, hey. Yeah, that's what you think. Ah, I'm you're a nigga. nigga. <laughs> I'm a nigga. You're a nigga. You're a nigga. You're hoping that bitches are scared of me. Yeah. It's not that you're thinking. You're hoping that. I'm, I'm wrong. No, no. You're hoping because I'm competition. I'm a nigga. And I don't like you're competition to me, bro. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah I, I don't compete with fish. So. <laughs> Do 
Yeah. I'm, 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 I'm playing with their minds, the guy. Oh, fuck, yeah. It's I'm not to say to the boys, that boys, yeah. when you get money and everything else, you can't be going to the same broke black sisters. Because most black sisters are broke. So now, the type of woman that you need to be trying to attract... But I wanna, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Just listen to what I'm saying. The type of woman needs to, needs to be women that are seen as unattainable. Yeah. You understand know what I'm saying? As long as you've got a pretty white bitch, she doesn't need to be a pop star. She doesn't need to be famous or anything else. If you've got a pretty white bitch, you're shutting down the club. Doesn't matter if Pearl to see is, 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 is there. Is there, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he was the MC at Crystal's wedding. He's yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. He MC, he sang, yo. Yeah. 
Do you still talk of Kwasi? No. You don't? No. Hanati, my brother, Chima, Klee. No. Is there the conversation no. with uh, the cross Wally? I never had a conversation with them. Never? No. You brought them here? Yeah, uh, and Wally also took care of me when I was in New York. I went to Wally Mania, he brought me up there, he put me on the stage, he introduced me to a whole lot of people. I met Peter Rosenberg, the guy who worked with Ebro. Okay. I met a whole lot of other rappers that are out there. I met uh, he, he, Wally plugged me with all these people. Out there, no. Wale is uh, the guy who was the videographer for Wale. No. Uh, was at a, a party, right? And then when he's at the party, he was smoking a joint uh-huh. outside. And then while he's smoking a joint, Jay Z then steps out to smoke a joint. It was the two of them outside. He was there. Yes, that Wale, Wale is with a former videographer. Uh-huh. Wale is former videographer. Then speaks to Jay Z, and then two days later, my Twitter account comes back. Wow. <laughs> we don't, you don't know the position. I do have a conversation. I've got, I've got, no, 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 no. You don't get a good conversation between them. No. No, I know the conversation because the nigga called me. He said, don't do come and get the water. I spoke to the nigga. He was just having a smoke. Jay- he, 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 he was having a smoke outside. Né? It's like you're at the VIP section né? and you go outside where you. I no, tell you. Relax, relax. Listen to the story. <laughs> Listen to the story. Sure. Listen to the story. Listen yeah. to the story, right? You're at the VIP section. Right? Where you're allowed to relax. Fuck. Né? Outside. Né? Smoking. Yeah. And then, Jay-Z walks out to smoke. And now you've got an opportunity to speak to Jay-Z because you are kind of, you are too, you're outside. And mm-hmm. they said you are in a VV, VIP place. So everybody has VIP. Yeah. So it's not like, you know, you're not supposed to be here. Yeah, huh? and so he said, yo, please. And then my Twitter account was unbanned two days later. <laughs> no, I want to ask you this, bro. I say my name, I show. Say Val, say Val, say Val. Mm. Now I'm going to translate the translation. Mm. No, do, you, do you regard yourself as being big? Do you? Like, as, as, as being big? Like, as in famous? Yeah. Yeah, no, I know. I, 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 no, I, no, I can see my face. I know I can see my face because I've worked, I know you with, smart, with, smart, smart. I've worked with people who are famous the whole time. So I used to check if the person I'm working with is at that level of fame. I used to be able to say, okay, how many people are taking t- 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 pictures in? Let me tell you. As you look at the line, you say, that's the line for AKA's table, what's the line for Chris's table? Okay. That's a problem. Let me ask you. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. You understand? So for, now I have to make sure that I reduce that line there and I make it here. Yeah. And then I, I have to check the, the line at Chris's table and reduce that line there. Wow. And I've done that. I've achieved that. You, yeah. you need to understand that these other niggas in the game, what KO and everything else, KO could not beat AKA and Casper. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. He's on top of them in the charts right now. After they've fallen off, yeah, yeah. thanks to Young Stana. Uh-huh. You understand what I'm saying? But in their prime, you could not beat them. Cuesta beat them in their prime. Uh-huh. You understand? Cuesta beat um, AKA Casper, made them irrelevant, opened the door, so uh-huh. and an SDC and an MT could come also into the space. Yeah. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. we, we need to look beyond Casper and AKA. The, the first person to make South Africa look beyond Casper and AKA is Cuesta. Because he's the first person to outdo them. But it, was, it was even one that, uh, what was the. What's that, that song, Good? Doesn't matter whether he's on with him or the song, dog. You, you have to associate with him. It's not about you know, associating with an enemy, dog. It's not an enemy, dog. Why does it have to be an enemy? Why do you have to use the word enemy? You want him to be sued. No. no. You want him to be sued. It's, right? not, okay. it's not that I want him to be sued. Yeah. Dude. And you're like, yeah, yeah, they 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 must, see, must see them two million, two million dollars, they must give you... You said 20,000, 20 million. 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 They, they million. must give you 10. No, 100 million. I told them to get 100 million, yeah. And, and you were saying you're yeah, the only one who wanted to. I'm, I'm, I am. Yes, yeah, so I own shares in Rembro. Rembro owns. But I am, dog. I own. So, dog, when the company makes a profit and they make it, they talk. So, okay. so, 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 so what do you No, wait, listen. Fuck, man. Stop this shit. Because that's the thing, they're just stupid. That's why you blacks are fucking poor, man. You're stupid. <laughs> Oh, it's as a shit. Wait for me. 
has a shareholder. The farmers is selling. Casper put up. The product is selling. You don't care. They pro- it don't, this is going to help the car. It don't care. My product <laughs> is, in, is being advertised. Would you say? Hold on, wait, wait. Would you say okay, it's not true. 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 It's not He's being sued in a personal capacity. Ah, okay. You understand? Know yeah. In personal capacity. And why? You, are you, you also want to play DJ Shims or for calling me a, a, a track boy? <laughs> I never called him on a track boy. Ah, you did. But he's you giving you 200,000. So? That's what the news are saying. Is that money to you? Did you? Is it money to you? Ah, okay. Sorry. 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 The next time you must sue me, I'll give it to you. <laughs> Yeah. Would you come back? Yeah. Bruh, like it's been two hours of past shooting. Okay, good. Having a conversation between yeah. me and you. Yeah. And when we started it, you were somewhat sober. But now you're tired. <laughs> In fact. <laughs> This guy is not a job one. I'm gonna get fucked. And I was so scared. Remember you were sitting outside at the balcony there alone? Yeah. And I'm like, I'm really gonna talk to this guy. But thank you so much, brother. No, I really appreciate you, man. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a conversation which didn't come in without a tara. Oh, voila. Shop, shop, subscribe. We need new lights. Yes. <laughs> no, tara.